Guys, episode two, we're back. Is this thing on? Yeah. Is this thing on? Welcome in. It's on, it's on. Look, and we sorted out chat so it stays as well. So it's better than last time. For anyone that got hit by the pre-roll Actual ads, streamer. shut up. You've got five seconds. Yo, Liz, welcome in. Actual Liz. Yo, I has a mustache with an actual first. Welcome in, guys. Welcome in. Welcome in. Sorry, we're a bit late, but uh, you know how it is. You know how it is sometimes. Also, it's got Definitely a wouldn't be a Thomas stream if we were on time, would it? It's got a crack open a bit. We would have been if it weren't for those meddling kids. Hey, yo. Don't ask whose kids. <laughs> not mine. <laughs> Definitely not mine. Fucking hell. We started off, started off the cast on that, on that wave. Yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> Mad. Just wanted to say hello. <laughs> Just wanted to pop in and say hello. It's sadly bedtime. Oh, no. We'll definitely, we'll definitely do one at a more Liz friendly time. We promise. We promise. We'll make it. Yeah, I, I think we did speak about this before. Potentially doing some, uh, like some US friendly. Yeah. Time streams as well. My streams are uh. usually NA friendly, so like EU friendly is just weird for my usual audience, which is like most of it is like twenty three percent of it's probably you know forty three percent is US, twenty three percent UK. And then the other third is just everywhere else on the fucking atlas. But, yeah, guys. So, episode number two. Obviously, if you were here, you would have seen episode number one um, with our amazing guest, Kaito Nolan, who I hope is okay. Um, I assume she's okay by now. Hey, big up her. She was in a way. She was great. Into that cast. She was a great sport. <laughs> like, she was, just, she was just down for everything. And really nice. And like she said on the stream, me and her have never actually spoken before. But she seemed very nice. From my own personal experience, she was very nice and very relatable and very easy to talk to. Uh, good, love that, man. Good shit. Good shit. 3 p.m. here. Yeah, I just work nights. Oof. Yeah, I feel that. I feel that. Right. Let me just... Right. Let me just... Oh, man. Kick us off, brother. Let's just do it. Let's Give do us a this. sick intro. Come right. on, man. So, guys... Like I said, this is episode number two, right? The premise of the podcast. So we usually start with a bit of an intro and then we go straight into some Pokemon Go stuff. That doesn't usually take up too much of the cast. Um, we try not to anyway, but we feel like we have to put Pokemon Go stuff in there because we love Pokemon Go. You guys love Pokemon Go. But you know what else we love? We love beer. So beer usually takes up most of the podcast. That will be coming up after the Pogo segment. So it'll go Pogo and then beer. We've got a sort of a, a fun twist on the beer segment. We're going to be... Uh, actually, I'm not even going to say. You, go, you guys have to wait. You guys have to stick Maybe around. Stay. Yeah, Maybe even wait. Yeah, you, you, you guys don't even get to know now. So you, you guys have to stay until that part to see what we're doing there. And then we move on to a bit of a shit chat segment called the banter segment. LOL. So we're going to be doing some reactions and whatnot, some stories, all of that good stuff. And then, uh, yeah, then we wind things up, tell you guys what we've got planned next, um, individually and for the cast, next episode details as well, future special guests, so all of that good stuff, but I do want to start with a disclaimer that this podcast is solely for entertainment purposes, we do not advocate overconsumption or abuse of alcohol, and we do not promote binge drinking, all guests have the choice whether they want to consume alcohol or not, and it is their responsibility to drink responsibly. Just had to put one, put that Hashtag one out. Not scripted. Just had to put that one out there because we've got. There you we, go, mate. We're dropping bodies on stream, or bodies are dropping on stream. Sorry, I do credit That's myself. It, man. <laughs> That's it, man. Bodies are dropping. Cheers to that, brother. Yes. Cheers. Got to be sensible, chin, guys. Cheers. Don't drink and drive. And in case you guys, and if you guys for some reason don't know, uh, this is the I Booze You podcast. Myself, Josh, Mr. Avalanche, and my good friend, co-host Thomas Young. 1987, Not gov name included. Oh, and yeah, guys, thanks everyone for being here. Um, this is a live podcast, so feel free to get involved in the chat. Let us know what you're thinking. You know, get involved, man. We're for a good time, innit? I don't know. I'm going to quickly do something. So... Here we go. Tech issues. No, no, no. It was you, man. You sounded like a robot. Man was like, I have missed that avalanche. Oh, is it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what was going on there. Right, we're going to go... I'm going to go straight into it. So we've got this little scene here, guys. Not as elaborate as the other scene, which, by the way, Josh's good friend, Red Flash. If you guys don't know Red Flash, check him out. The timer will come up at some point, shouting him out. 
Um, yeah, makes great content, great artwork, great emotes. All round great guys. Great so, guy. Yeah, if you guys check out the initial tweet I put out on Twitter, I credited him in the in the post with the little art logo. So definitely drop him a follow and check out some of his work because it is amazing. I wish I was half as good. It's amazing. But without further it ado, is, it is. that is my stream manager. You guys don't need to see this, you nosy little shit. So we're gonna go on. Yeah. We're gonna go on to this first event. Josh, do you wanna do you wanna kick this one off, or would you like me to? Yeah, I'm out. Kick it off, bro. Go on, go on. Go. So, Today, the uh, the out to play event started. Um, this is nothing too wild, to be honest. Uh, Wednesday, twenty seventh September to October second. Um, wild spawns. We've got Psyduck, Growlithe, Onyx, Eevee, Feebas, Woobat, Pommy, and Arcanine spawning in the wild. Um, pretty mid, to be honest. It's a bit unless, underwhelming. unless you need unless you, Onyx, unless you uh, need Onyx and like, Growlithe just had its spotlight hours, so. You shouldn't need growlers. Exactly, yeah. Um, the eggs, which to be honest, are Ooh, not great, but we've now got the uh, the uh, the Hisuian Growlif is now available to be shiny. Nice. Very nice shiny. They've just made it. They've made it way too hard to uh, to get. To be honest. Egg locking it. Um, Event bonuses. You're gonna be able to get more Kecleons. If anyone still hasn't finished their uh, their masterwork research, now is the time to get out and do it. Uh, you got three times XP for completing a route if you're lucky enough to have them in your city, uh, and you earn buddy candor two thirds times faster while exploring routes with your buddy. Field research tasks: we've got um, Hisuian Growlithe, uh, Hisuian Sneasel, Hisuian Quillfish, and Pormy. Uh, tasks are pretty bad as well. I know the Hisuian Growlithe is three eggs, hatch two, three eggs three or walk. Eggs, yeah. Uh, it's three and and or walk five kilometers, which is pretty meh to be honest. Oh, shit. Uh, there's a free timed research. You get some stardust encounters with the Growlithe along the way. That's basically just walk five kilometers, and you just get encounters along the way. Yeah. Uh, you got the timed paid research for two dollars or whatever it is equivalent to your time zone. I've got that for. You're going to get six encounters with his Huey and Growlithe, five encounters with regular Growlithe, two incubators, and one super incubator. Can't be, can't, um, can't be mad at a super, super incubator, really. Nah. Can't be mad at it. There's, there is uh, showcases, uh, which is going to be Growlithe, which at the minute are bugged, I believe. Mm. So, you know, I saw some there. people getting like got a... over a thousand on. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, I've got one of those too. That's mad. Um, uh, and then, yeah, you've got that cool wig available in the stuff, 200 Pokecoins. Um, and a route update, which from playing today, I'm not sure if I actually believe it or not. So there's going to be more routes available across the globe. You now have to be a lower level to create routes. Um, you're going to be able to see how many Zygarde cells you've collected easier. And it says in the future, Trainers will be able to create more routes. Uh, you'll find Zygarde cells more often, and there'll be uh, notifications to let trainers know when there are routes nearby and other quality of life improvements incoming. So, that's about it. To be honest, this is probably an event you can skip, in my opinion. Yeah. Um, you know, which is it isn't a bad thing, but yeah, it's pr pretty mid. To be honest. Yeah, I guess they know people. It's one of those events where new shiny. They know they're gonna get a lot of people, people playing it just because of the new shiny. But they haven't exactly made it easy to get the shiny. So if they had it in field, what do they have the Growlithe in field research at least? No. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so it's ha oh, so it's do, hatch three eggs or walk five kilometers. Okay. So which yeah, are still pretty long easy. to be honest. Still definitely yeah, no, not definitely easy. not easy by any means. Not other than that. Um, right, let's get into, the, get into the next little bit. You want to cover this one? Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Let's go. So we'll go. We'll go with Azrael Hatch Day. So I believe they had um, not too long ago. Like they had the actually, no, it feels like quite a while ago. They had that GVL. Event, it was like, really, wasn't it? Where everyone got their their Marrow. Everyone got their yeah. Marrow um, from like the GBL Research Day or whatever it was called or the 
Battle Day. Where, that was back when it was called Battle Day rather than the Battle Weekend. So here we've got the Azrael Hatch Day starting this Saturday at 2 p.m. local, finishing at 5 p.m. local. And the long and short of it is Azrael will hatch more frequently in two kilometer eggs. And you have increased shiny chances. So, yeah. other Dead. Yeah, it is dead. Like, if you're someone like me that doesn't really hatch eggs, this event is not going to get you to do it. It's not really, you know, yeah, it doesn't really do anything for me. But you get two times Stardust from hatching eggs, two times Candy from hatching eggs, and you'll get two kilometer eggs much more frequently from your from your Pokestops. So, yeah, if you're someone that, you know, likes hatching eggs and, you know, you want to, you've got a lot of incubators, want to zip through a lot, it might be the event for you. If you're someone that still needs a shiny, um, you don't really hatch many, you know, eggs in general to get shiny babies, you know, this, again, another good event for you. And like all these events, you've got some timed research, which, you know, you, you complete that, then it's like, oh, that's basically, that's basically it. And you've got a web store bundle as well. So they've got some web store bundles oh. there. I mean, I don't know about you, but I think the big problem with the event that actually they did was uh was Realu. Okay, yeah. But to go that was a good one. But to go from Realu to Azorio Azurio is like yeah levels, man. Like yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. It's it, um, it's, ch it's chalk and cheese. It's say uh, like it's a bad. Yeah. It's a it's very it's a very bad event in my opinion, but yeah, definitely. Apparently, they felt like they needed it, so. We got one more piece to cover, right? Community day. Do you wanna? Do you wanna go into? Yeah, yeah, man. Community? I'll I'll smash through this, man. This. I'll smash through this. Very excited. So the community day for October is Timber, which is to be honest, quite a good one. Yep. Very hype, to be honest. So uh, so yeah, so Timber will appear more frequently in the wild, and if you're lucky enough, you might encounter a shiny. The shiny is quite nice. It turns into a little like gold mole it's quite nice uh and if you evolve it um it gets brutal swing which is a pretty good move for pvp right yes. mm. it's a good move for pvp but i don't know if conkeldor is a real i don't think it's going to benefit from I don't it know right conkeldor's better the only thing it benefits from is because now it has a 40 energy move, whereas before it just had dynamic punch and stone edge, which it gets to at the exact same time. Yeah. So now it's got a bait move. Whether it's a good bait move, it's still it now has bait potential, which brutal swing aside, they could have given it any 40 energy move. So it just yeah. has bait potential now, which means if you run brutal swing and let's say stone edge, you might I don't know, you might get a bit of a better like ho matchup in yeah. Open Masters. Or if you have brutal swing dynamic punch, you might have a bit of a better the Alga matchup or something. I don't know. So I'd have to look into yeah. it. Um, but it looks it looks like an upgrade, but not much of one, to be honest. Yeah, I, I think it's more just a fan favourite Pokemon. Oh, this, oh uh, Conk, Conk is so cool. Yeah. Conk uh, is to go. Um, uh, and obviously you've got the, uh, the $1 special research, which is always available. And in my opinion... One of the best value things that they actually offer in this game that is paid. It's always worth it, uh, yeah. The event bonus is three times dust. Everyone's favourite. Everyone loves triple dust com days, and it's you know it's a good com day worth doing. Yep. You know, grab some friends, family, go out for a walk on that day, get it done. Um, two times candy for catching Pokemon. Two times chance for XL candy. Uh, Law modules will last three hours during com day. Incense will last three hours during com day. Uh, take five snapshots during Com Day, and you'll get five timber encounters as well. You get an extra special trade for the day, and trades cost fifty percent less Stardust. And after, as always, with the new feature from five pm till ten pm, there will be um, the raids of the middle evolution, which will then give you thirty minutes extra spawns from five pm till ten pm local time. So. These are in person only, so if you're going to do them, make sure you've got people with them because they they can be pretty tough to beat. But the rewards are pretty good, to be honest. Get more spots. Um, Can't complain. Yeah, and then other than that, there's there's going to be uh, there's going to be field research as well for encounters with timber, great balls, ultra balls, and more, and stickers, and that is it. Yeah. Oh, well, this is new. Uh, I'm looking on the thing now, looking for other trainers to join. Looks like there's a uh... I don't know if this is new or if it's the first time I've seen it, but they've got like 
commu- a thing called community parks. So I guess they're quite... Um, so I'm looking at the key now. So they've got community ambassador activations. So I guess this allows you to connect with your local community ambassador and their communities if you're someone that's either a rural player or don't really have much of a community. And there's community parks as well. So they're basically just highlighting different parks and areas within your local community yeah. that are good to play. So that's always good. And then they've got the general yeah. health guidelines. I, I mean, it's a good so. idea. I just think it's, uh, I think it's poorly executed. I, th- I feel like this should be relatively high up in the page yeah, yeah you know the idea is to get out and play with people but it's community yeah so it's, um, yeah you want yeah for sure yeah what's the point in leaving that bit above oh by the way you have a local community it's community day like that should be like you said front and center exactly, yeah, yeah that should be front and center exactly yeah but yeah guys for pogo yeah, that is news, it? that's pretty much it for pogo in terms of the events and stuff I just need to get up a Twitter thread. Bear with me one second, guys. Because I don't know if you guys have seen on Twitter or Discord or just whatever you guys use to keep up to date with Pogo news and stuff. But Wayfarer. Wayfarer has been going crazy, guys. I don't use Wayfarer. It's so been doing a madness, I'm a bit, brother. It's I'm a been bit, doing a madness. I'm a bit ignorant. So, so like, correct me if I'm wrong. So my understanding of Wayfarer and how it works is... You basically you submit in like points of interest as stops. you sub- it's basically like an, an alternate way of submitting like stops within cells and stuff rather than just doing it through the game. Something like that. Like I really don't know. Okay, about so it. okay, so I I'll, I'll quickly summarize it. So it. Uh, the way you submit stops now has completely changed from what you're talking about. So now okay. every time you submit a stop. Um, it will go through Wayfarer, okay. basically, which is Niantic's website, which provides um, it provides portals and POIs across all of their game titles, yep. and they're all completely now um, uh, community-based uh, applications, basically. Okay. So nothing, you can't do it the old way anymore. It all has to go through Niantic Wayfarer. Yep. Yep, it all goes through that. Fair enough, fair enough. Say, like, yeah, people are just... People are getting done dirty. Like, I saw it the other month with Green Beef. He got done dirty, yeah. 30 days. And then more recently, I am literally... My ex took so long to load there. But I'm now... I had it on bookmarks, so that's quite handy. Let me just unhide the internet source. Da da da. Do you guys see that? Yes, you can. So let me... Jump on there. Just read chat. Yo, we've got Pete Scottford in chat. Welcome in. We've got two Pete's in chat. Pete Scottford, Peter Monjord. So many Pete's. So, right. yeah, Pete. Pete Patrol. So, this, this is the most recent case. You can see the views on that. 177k views. Obviously, he's tagged two of the, the main sort of accounts for niantic and wayfarer in terms of let me just follow it just so i can see what shenanigans they get up to so he got banned he's not sure why and how um obviously this is someone that's he's quite he's quite well known in terms of european pvp like he's top cutted previous european tournaments and stuff so he's obviously spent a fair amount of his money to to go to lil and his account's been banned. And the date in which it says is September 26th. So that's yesterday. And Lil is less than 30 days away. So it's saying his suspension will last approximately yeah. 30 days. Um, I mean, I believe, to skip to the end, I believe it has been resolved. But at the same time, looking at all of this, like, he, he believes that it's something to do with someone deleting photos in his area. Like, how, how would that result in him getting banned? Okay, so, so I, I do have my own personal opinion on this. So, first of all, I would like to say that um, he has now been unbanned. Yeah. Has now been confirmed. Yeah. Uh, which is good. Love to see it. The biggest problem with the Wayfarer system is squares and trolls. So, <laughs> there are a lot of people who are really quite hardcore to Wayfarer. Like, really hardcore. Yeah. Um, it, they, like... They live and breathe it. Um, there is a very strict criteria you have to follow to get uh, stops into go. Yep. From then, 
is you then have trolls in game who can then affect that, which I've recently experienced myself. So if you go into go and you click on any waypoint, like any Pokestop, yep. click on the name at the top, and in the bottom right, it will come up with a selection of pictures from that stop. All it takes is a, is a number of people to go in there and report it, and because you've submitted it, it comes back to you. The, the system is extremely flawed. Yeah. Um, and to be honest, like there are a lot of people who kind of go out of their way to be dickheads about it, to be quite honest. Yeah. Um, I've, well, so I built most of my playing area yeah. using, you know, submissions and Wayfarer. After seeing all this stuff, I will not be submitting anything because, like, it's not worth it. Yeah. It's, it's literally not worth it. They have it. to think as well. It's uh, like they're going to lose people like yourself that like developing their community in terms of the points of interest and, oh yeah, for sure. you know, sure. making grinding um, spots and stuff. But it's more the people. Like, I don't submit anything and, like, Say, I'm the same now. Like, seeing this, like, is this going to incentivize me to want to submit stuff? Because, no, of course no, not. It's, it's never, I'm, never, I'm not going to take that risk now. There's too much time, no, of course not. money, and everything invested into this account. Mm. And, like I said before, Snorek, someone that he goes to quite a lot of the European tournaments, as you can see by his name, he's due to go to the next, yeah, not the next four exactly, but he's going to go to the next two. And then he's going to go to Dortmund and EUIC. So yeah. if he catches another ban again, he might, he might not be able to appeal it as easy. I think that's, Unski. that's something that Unski. Got, that's, that's something that got said as well. Let me have a scroll down. Because yeah. um, he filled out the appeal. I'm going to quickly say, sorry, uh, I'm going to quickly jump in and say, clearly did not read a pinned message, brother. But thank you for joining us. Thank you for the three points. We we appreciate that, man. Yeah, Jay got scammed. Sorry, Jay. We can't. Hi, we, sorry, Jay. We can't. Um, we can't redeem you. But what we can do is we can. Um, can give you a shout out. I'll give you a shout out, Jay, to make up for it. Actually, Josh, do you want to give a shout out while I scroll down? If you give a sh shout out to Jay, it's the least we could do for his troubles. You're On it. Welcome in, Jay. We're just talking about some uh, wayfarer uh, shenanigans. Um, I don't know what any of that means. That's all in German. But looking at it now. Um, Let's see, he he sent the he sent the appeal, but I'm trying to see where it says if it um, happens to him again, then he gets banned uh, again. No, uh, so 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 I don't think there's anything that says it. That's just kind of the process that they go for. Okay. Um. Yeah. But no, yeah, enough, it's it's pr it's pretty it is it's pretty horrible. Like the whole Wayfair system is terrible. Yeah. I've had quite a number of stops myself that have just been straight up denied. And they are legitimate stops. Oh, um, wow. I've got a really good friend, um, uh, MXFI. Yeah. He is a hardcore wayfarer. Love it. He's he's submitted like over like three hundred successful stops that have gone into the game. Jesus. And some of the stuff, and some of the stuff that has been rejected on mine, I will say to him like, why? And he's like, I've got no idea. But apparently, it's quite common within the wayfarer community. Yeah. They do just like to troll. Yeah. Basically, for literally no reason. How, I, um, well, I was gonna say why, but you literally hit the nail on the head. People, you don't need to give people a reason, you know. If if they've yeah. got if they've got the bit between their teeth, they're gonna they're gonna fuck some shit up. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, they're gonna ruin so, it for um, everyone. Yeah, yeah, it's not great, man. But, but um, yeah, this story, I, I'm glad it did get resolved and quite promptly as well, because like I said, he may have to start looking into cancellations and everything, which for a lot oh, of yeah, people, definitely. yeah, a lot of people, you don't get all your money back, so. Yeah, so I'm glad that got resolved. Yeah, it's um. I definitely well, I mean, so I recently had it as well. So, so I submitted a route uh, to my local playing area. Yeah. Um, it had 550 community visits. I think you showed me this. And yeah, yeah, and it was then removed for apparently not being safe. Yeah. Basically, and it was like it follows a pathway the entire time. You don't cross any roads. Yeah. Anything like that. So it, it it's just trolls basically. That like that's it. And that that's part of where the problem is, you know, within this game. Yeah. But but then the problem is I didn't have a chance to like defend it. Yeah. Like it was just gone. Straight up gone. Deleted. Yeah. Well you didn't have a chance to appeal it or anything. Nope. That's sad. So so what I've done as a little test is I've taken that exact same route. Oh no. And I've split it into three, three. and oh. submitted it. Yep. Yeah. And submitted it, and if they all go through, yeah, 
Nothing wrong with the route, how, is there? How long was the original route? It was a mile and a bit. So you've split it um, up into basically, because obviously the routes need to be about five hundred and something. You've split it up into yeah. as like as small as small routes can be, whilst yeah. essentially, you know, being the same route, essentially the same yeah. route with little checkpoints. Yeah. So... Yeah, literally the same route, the exact same route. But you know, it's, it, it is crap. Um, I've I've seen it happen quite a lot yeah. to people this last week, and I I, I hope it's something that. I was getting tied out. It does it, need it does need addressing because it's, it's, it's pretty silly. It's pretty shit. Like, yeah. like you know, let's be honest, it's fucking shit. Yeah. Um, Don't get me wrong. They're so quick, uh, they're so quick to jump on people that are submitting routes or like all the wayfarer stuff. But when people are actually exploiting the game, you know, when people are exploiting the game with like spoofing and a Discord bot. Um, I know, I know you see yeah. Jay's message. Are you gonna? You gonna yeah, make, yeah. I just you gonna yeah. make the man wait. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I'll do it if you don't. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it, it, no, 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 it, no, it's fine. It's fine. I'm going to drop it at some random point, so he has to stay in and watch. Now I'm panicking, because no panic. Okay. Oh, I'm going to lose my no. job. I'm going to lose my job. <laughs> yeah. Jesus. Yeah. Now if Jay leaves, at least he's got his. He's got his wish. Hey, uh, Jay, enjoy, mate. That's worth more than 100 channel wow. points. So you've been well and truly yeah. redeemed, sir. But yeah. yeah. Oh, he's going to clip it as well, isn't he? Oh no no no! He, he <laughs> weren't he it. weren't he weren't until you said that you little pagan. Right. Yeah. Anyway, so we're glad the Wayfarer situation got sold for this trainer here. But like you said, like we've all come to know now, you know Wayfarer, mm -mm, stay away, stay away. Yeah, yeah, just don't man. It's don't it, it. It, it's not worth it. Like like it, it, even if they're stone, like you know, like stone wall. Yeah. Valid. Stops. Just, just yeah. Don't. It's not worth They'll it. Find something. Someone out there will. Someone out there's out there to troll you, man. Yeah, exactly, exactly. It's not a nice world we live in. But that aside, ah. that is actually it for the Pogo stuff. So we are going to go. Yo, to... Lankan, welcome in, man. Yo, we got Lankan in chat. Yo, Lankan, thank you Big for the man follow. Lankan. Thank you for the follow. Um, if you guys haven't seen, because um, I think you've all seen. I think it's only Jay that didn't see. But we've turned off all the alerts and sound redemption just because. Um, we are recording this, and this will go. Manson <laughs> roasted him, like putting him on blast. It. <laughs> I'm sorry. Look, I'll, look, I will take all the corn that he's gonna give us when. Um... Yeah, I don't know where I was going with that. Oopsie, oopsie. I spoke oopsie. too soon. Oopsie. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah. Also, I don't know. I don't know why no one is roasting you for having light mode on. Oh, I don't use Twitter on it. I don't use X. Oh, on, I don't use man. X on my PC. It doesn't matter, man. On my phone, it's in dark mode. You don't need to allow me. I've got Discord in light as well. I don't. I don't have Discord in light. That's no, 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 no. I don't. I don't. I don't. Um, yeah, right, right guys. Let's move on We're to... fucking the Pogo stuff up. We're going on to the... My favourite bit of the... The good shit. ...of this pod. Where has it gone? dun dun dun, dun. Right, let me know if you guys can see that, because obviously I'm not on OBS, so I can't see what you guys see. I can only see what I can see. I see Grammarly. I don't want Grammarly. Yeah, 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 yeah. There it is. It so, is. so we're kicking, we're, we're kicking the non-pogo stuff off with a, uh, with a little tier list. So I've turned about a tier list for Man said little. ages now. Man Fucking said little. Ages. Look at the size of that cause. You can't even see the logo. <laughs> what happened to the cause? <laughs> but, yeah, but. So, you know, being, you know, a, a, a orientated podcast, it would feel wrong to not do a, you know, little fucking you know? yeah. Okay, so I made this tier list myself. It took me fucking ages because I didn't know what the fuck I was doing. But yeah, so the rules are simple, Thomas. So we have got five categories. We've got Nectar of the Gods. Five tiers. Like, yeah, yeah. The, like, like the upper echelon. We've got yeah. Elite. We've got decent bev. We've got you know if I have to, and then we've got I'd rather drink my own piss. Which to be fair, a few of these fall into that category for me personally. Yeah. Um. But yeah, man. Let's uh, uh let's get off, man. So first up, we've got Brewdog Lost Lager. Now for me, for me, this is nectar. You think this is nectar? But for, for me, this is the one of. The best lagers ever. I'm looking. I'm just trying to look at the rest of the list to see if anything. Because I'd say Brewdog's minimum elite. I think we're in agreement. It's minimum, minimum uh, uh, elite. Uh, uh, okay. 
It's minimum there. But I'm looking... So, okay, but, but that I would also say, I have very fond memories of Lost Lager because I was drinking it actually when I first met you. Oh, we're talking Lost Lager. We're not talking Brewdog. No, 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 oh, no. we're oh, talking yeah, Lost Lager. Oh, that's going up there, right. All right, we're moving on. Yeah. Um, that's, going, yeah. that's going up there. Yeah, yeah easy. There we go. Just easy clap. Just because on, on the picture, just it's cut off, isn't it? So when you're talking Brewdog, you could be yeah. talking about anything. Yeah. yeah, Lost Lager, guys. If you haven't had Lost Lager... So, it's so nice. So I tried quite a lot on that night, that magical night that me and Mr. Avalanche locked eyes across the room, it, took many photos. It's beautiful. Yeah, he, beautiful. He and came, here we are now. He came um, to the bar and uh, wanted to take a picture. So, um, and on his face. Basically. But the, yeah, the last lager was good. I tried quite a few of the. <laughs> no, honestly, I, I wasn't just glossing <laughs> over that. You're cutting up a bit. I, I can't lie. You are cutting up a little bit. I don't know if that's the same for everyone else, but. Wait, you should be... Okay, I can hear you now. You should be all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. So, Nectar of the Gods, Brew Dog. Because what is um Dog Backwards? God, there we go. Enough said, enough said. There you go, mate. Little in between us, yeah? Enough said. <laughs> right. Okay. Next right. up. You, right, you start us next. Right. I'm interested here. Right. Des Desperados. Desperate Rados. Okay. Um, this is interesting because I've... I've had Desperados in a bottle, and I've had little Desperados cans. Which, the Desperados cans, if we're talking about cans, the cans are dead. Don't have the cans. The cans, I literally rather drink my own piss. The bottles, mm. the bottles, however, are very, very nice. Get a lime wedge in the top, Bob's your uncle. However, I'm looking at the other beers on the list, and I might just have to put it as decent Bev. I, I Mate, think, I think I'm going to cut you in it. Go on. Mate, I'm going to cut you off it. I would simply rather drink my own piss. I think, I think if you drink Desperado as a grown man, you're, yeah. there's a few scenarios, right? Your wife is, is left you and oh, takes kids and the money and you, yeah. you're spiraling out of control. Or you basically want to tell people you like beer, but you don't take, but you don't like the taste of beer. No, I can agree with that. So let me let, let me ask you a question. If I if I went to if I went somewhere and didn't have anything else really that good, and I bought you a bottle of Desperados, would you drink it? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. I would sooner shit in my hands and clap. I, Personally, the thing is, I'm a sick, uh, I'm a sick bastard. However, Go on. Ha yeah. <laughs> however, for for this tier list to be official, we have to come to a conference. I think if right, someone... So if someone decent, I, know, I reckon if I have to, if someone bought me it and they're like, see it off, then I'm like, I would see it off. But like, if I had the choice, I wouldn't necessarily buy it. And I don't think I've drunk... Mate, if he's got... Sorry, go well, mate. I was going to say, I don't think I've drunk Desperado since I was a student. Like, and the only reason, by the way, I forgot to say, the only reason I had those Desperado cans is because um, my mate was like, uh, he worked for like their local estate... Um, what, I'm not a state agent. It was local like a, estate agent? No, I was going to say... Man said local estate agent. Shut up, man. You know what I mean. No, a student house, it was some student housing team. And for some reason, he ended up with loads of crates of these little Desperados cans. So then we went through them just, and we thought they were right because we didn't pay for them. So I reckon it's uh, if I have to. But on the... Me personally, I'd put it on the upper end of if I have to compared to the other stuff on there, but it doesn't go. It doesn't get much higher than that, I don't think. I think that's about... Okay, it's right. on the lower end of the scale. Right, I will settle for that. Yeah. Right. I will settle for that. Soul. Soul, I'm driving my own piss. It is inferior to Corona. And Desperado, yeah. every level. Yeah, we're not even... Completely. We're not debating that like, one. Soul like, the fact, like, 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 the fact that I've just absolutely slayed to Desperados, and that follows it. And I would... Honestly, yeah. I'd drink yeah, so so was um, so was lucky it was afterwards in the list because so Oh yeah, straight up. Holy shit, no, that is not so is not nice. Whereas Desperado I used to think, you know what, that's actually alright when someone bought me it. So nah, worst I wouldn't even give it to my worst enemy. I wouldn't even yeah. Nah, I wouldn't couldn't do it. Nice. I couldn't do it. Obviously each to their own if it's <laughs> If that's your beer of choice, that's your beer of choice. But yeah, it's up to you. Uh, you're 
you also probably, you know, need to be able to register somewhere. You know, if you walk into a bar and your drink of choice is a soul. Yeah. You need to be on yeah. all sorts of, all sorts yeah. of neighbourhood... Not even just pub watch. Oh, that, yeah. Not even neighbourhood watch. Not even pub watch. You need to be on like all a, the a neighbourhood where nonce watch. You're going to get the fucking nonce yes. hunters coming yeah. after you. See, I was trying to avoid that. I was trying to not say, if you, you're drinking a choice of soul, you probably fuck kids. <laughs> that was what I was going to say, but you, you straight up like beat me to it. Listen, the, the game's the game. The game's the game. So if that's your drink of choice, that, that's up to you. But it's definitely not ours. Yeah, watch out, man. Right. Well, speaking yeah, man, of drink of not. choice, the Sunny Mig. The Sunny Mig. He's a, what a beautiful he, beer. He's a, he's a San Miguel fan. I love San Miguel. And honestly, the bottles are okay. nice. I think the bottles are... It depends where you get the San Miguel. The San Miguel at my pub I really like, but I've had San Miguel's at other pub, and I feel yeah. like it's less about the beer and more about their shitty fucking dirty line or their dirty nozzle or something. Anyway. Yeah. Oh yeah. Straight up. Yeah. San Miguel. But I think I think I think for this tier list, everything needs to be taken on its best day. So for me, Decent. when I think San Miguel, I think I'm I'm on holiday abroad. Yeah. Sat in the sun pint of San Miguel in a in a nice frosted glass. You know like the proper, the proper glasses ones. straight from the Yeah yeah. Uh, I mean, next to the God straight up. Yeah the thing is I drink San Miguel uh, so much so it's like Yeah. I just see it as something that's like I don't I don't necessarily put it on a pedestal because it's all I really drink. So for me it's just like Yeah. I don't know, it's just like it's it's a really nice beer. I'm just trying to look in relation I think to the it other needs to be at least. Yeah. It needs to be elite. Right. At least I don't think it's quite nectar of the gods. Yeah. Because you can get that nectar of the gods like like seven days a year, you know, when you're on holiday. Yeah, I reckon right. You know. We'll go we'll go elite and then we'll look at the others. It's like it's on the upper end of elite. Yeah, it's we'll sort say of it. like if we're talking Premier League um football teams, it's sort of like if we're saying nectar of the gods is like your Man City, um and whatnot. Elite is probably, yeah, I don't know. You're probably looking at Arsenal from last season. It's it's missing something <laughs> to put it up there. A good fucking goalie. Yeah. That's what we're missing. But anyway, yeah, I'd say Elite is pretty fair for San Miguel. Now we've got Stella your, your favourite beer. Your favourite beer. Oh, well, the old wife beer. Yeah. <laughs> to be fair, I know Thomas here is partial to a. Pint of the old Nelson. Oh, yeah. I'll dr- Listen, yeah, if I have to drink a Nelson Mandela at your pub, then I'll drink a Nelson Mandela at your pub. It's got to the be question nice. is, w- w- where would you rate it? I don't like it, Josh. I'm not going to lie. You see me drink all the time. It don't mean I like shit. I told you. I'm a filthy bastard. I'll drink it. <laughs> It'll look like I like it. I don't. <laughs> I don't. For me... For me, it's going to be if I have to. Yeah, 100%. If I have to, like, look, I'm in Woolwich. Me, I'm in I Woolwich. Have. I'm at the Elephant Castle. It's not even if I have to. I've got to. <laughs> I've got no choice. Hey, mate, to be, mate, to be, to be fair, mate, ne- next time you come down, you have to try uh, the cruise camp we've got. What's that? Uh, Spanish beer. Okay. We've got, a few Spanish, um, we've got a few Spanish ones coming up, so you'll have to... Is it is it on the list? Is it on the list or no? Yeah, of course it is. Yeah, come on. Oh, no, we've got Peroni. The, bo- the bottles are really tiny on mine, so I'm just going off of... Yeah. Peroni, Peroni. Yeah, right. Man. Peroni is one of them where on draft, anywhere you go, unless they do like neck oil or something else, Peroni's probably going to be the most expensive thing on tap. For whatever reason, it's, it's classed... It's decent, man. It's classed as a premium beer, but it is literally just... It's mid. I personally think it's, it's mid. It's decent. It's decent. Yeah, it I think decent, but I think like, there are at least there are at least um, five more beers left on this list that are better than Peroni. At least five that are better than Peroni. Yeah, okay. I, I, I'm happy with decent beer. Personally. Yeah, right. Decent Bev it goes. That's where Peroni is. Right. I can't see. Is that um? Is it Tiger or Cobra? I can't see. That's a Cobra. That, that is, is a Cobra. That is Cobra. I couldn't see. Oh no! Of course it's Cobra. Tiger's the fucking blue and. I can't, I can't fucking blind today. Right, Cobra. For anyone in the chat who, who isn't aware, Cobra has one use and one use only as a beer. Straight up, only one use. And I, I hope Thomas agrees, oh, but God. it is. But it's when you go for a curry, 
You sit in, you get your fucking vindaloo, yeah. and you have a bottle of cobra. Yeah. That is it. It's an Indian like, beer. It's an Indian beer, guys. It's meant to go with Indian food. Like you, you wouldn't go. You wouldn't go to a pub and order it before. and drink it. Like you I'm have not that. Straight out. You have that with your like Josh said. You got your curry. Got your bhajis. You got your papa dons. Garlic naan, kima naan, whatever. I said papa dons, nah. I said papa dons. Papa dons. I know it's papa dons. Papa dons, you know. I know it's papa dons. You idiot. Chicken booner, lamb booner, prawn yeah, booner. Yeah, <laughs> All yeah, the yeah, booners. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he forgot the cobra. That's one thing that um, Smithy forgot. He forgot the cobra in that order. Exactly. Then the order would have been perfect. I think based on that, it needs need to be decent. The second to last. No, I think I was just saying, like, you can't say it's decent, right? So if you walk into a bar. Okay, it's decent with a curry. Can we have a new tier? Decent with curry. <laughs> Nah, if it's... I have to, if I, if you have it a curry, yeah. you have to have it, sort of thing. Yeah, absolutely, because you can't say it's a decent bev. Nah, because, like, so, so if you went down to school, and they're like, oh, you know, it, you know, we're coming up, we're coming up today, the week when our delivery is tomorrow, kind of out of a lot. If you see Cobra, you're yeah. not fucking ordering. It. I'm sorry, you're not. You're not doing it. No, you're not. No, you don't go to a supermarket and look for the multi pack of Cobra. <laughs> Yeah, that's true. <laughs> you don't. Watch out, this thing fucks the cobra for, for a Wednesday night in. Oh, that's funny. Curry Yo, SA, thank you for the raid. Yo, SA, thank you for the raid. Sorry, Welcome in. Let me um, Welcome in. drop you a little shout out. Already on it. Already on it, brother. Nice, nice. I don't know if I follow you, SA, so we're going to find out when Josh does the Josh does the shout out. Josh, are you doing the Nightbot one or the Twitch one? Oh, we done the Twitch one. Nice. We, that will, one we will drop that's the that's the Twitch one. Yeah, we will drop you a follow. I say, I hope your stream went well. We're just uh, in the middle of ranking some beers. So if you're partial to a beer, do stay around and watch. Even if you're not, who knows? Looking at this list, oh, yeah. you, you you may try some of these based on our tier list. We this could be your way in. This could be your way in. So you'll know what not to drink. So if so if you're into a gateway. Yeah, first you're on the brew dog, <laughs> then you're on the fucking heroin. But anyway, so we've got Cobra. <laughs> we'll probably put it as if I have to, because it's like, I have to. look, okay. listen, the Curry House ain't got many beers on offer. If they ain't got Cobra, they might have a cheeky like Soul or an alternative similar. Yeah. But you you get the Cobra because it's better than Soul, basically. You've got yeah, no yeah. choice. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Um, right, we got Heineken next. Heineken? Sponsors of the Champions okay. League. Okay, but this is the regular Heineken. It's not the silver one. The Champions! Sorry, when I think Heineken, <laughs> I think of the Champions League. Yeah, this ain't the nice one. Mate, so. I've got my own head. Honestly, I, would, I think your Heineken is grim, to be honest. I'm I not, personally think so. I'm not a fan. I don't know how like so many people come to the pub and be like, have you got Heineken on taps? Uh, I'm like, no, we have not got Heineken on any of our taps. We've got Heineken and Heineken Mate, Zero. It's, it, it's just not it, is it? Nah, it's not the one. It's just not it. I, I mean, look, look, I'll put it this way. So, uh, so in my pub, we order from Heineken. And I don't order it from Oh, yeah, he Heineken's the... Yeah, but Heineken's the... What's it called? They do like other beers as well. Like obviously Heineken do the yeah, Heineken yeah. beer. They do others as well. So it's not just yeah. Yeah. Uh, for me, it's going to be drinking my own piss. Yeah. Definitely. I put it on. Uh, uh, I say it's slightly better than Soul, but I ain't saying much. It's not saying much. Yeah. That's, yeah, that's fine. Like yeah, it can just stay uh, there. To be honest, I didn't want to talk about it anymore. Right, coronavirus. Coronavirus. Okay. Hey. Okay, Corona is going to be, for me, just because we're taking it on, like, how it should be, got to be next for the gods. When you are sat, like, in a park with your mates, you crack open that, that cold bottle of Corona, yeah. a slice on the top. I you, think there's many things better in the world. Have you had Corona on draft before? I have. I really like it. Oh, it is nice. I really like, like it. it um, I re pub in Loughborough called the Griff. 
Mm. So you go to the griff, got the nice Corona glass. They still give you the lime. They don't do you out of a lime. Don't yeah. worry. Yeah. So did they did they have the new font with the uh, the little see through bit in it with the light? I can't say I've been to the griff very recently. Oh, mate, it's. Oh, it, I have it, to have a look. Yeah. I have to have one. Uh, uh, do I think it's better than Brewdog though? That is the question. No, I don't. I don't think it's better than Brewdog. No, I don't think. But I do think it is. I fact, no. It might be, might be elite because if you're drinking a Corona in the winter time, probably not. I reckon Corona's elite. Like, is it the drink of the summer? Yes. Yeah, I reckon. I reckon elite. It's a strong elite yeah, drink. That's fair. Yeah. Bang it there, bang it there. That one, where is that Australia? I can't see. Is that Australia? Australia, Australia yeah. Yes, it's Australia. It is Australia. I'm quite excited for it because Barcelona in 15 days. Oh, going to be go. pain in them back. Now, to be fair, I can imagine they'll taste quite nice abroad. I guess with these beers, you need, you need context. It's like, you know, if you're drinking it, you know, you're drinking it on holiday, in the sun, with your mates, with your missus, yeah. and oh, yeah, yeah. it's nice. But then, say, you could go to some shitty little pub, some shitty little boozer, and, you know, all the beer's shit, and they just so happen to do a straight up, and it ruins your, it ruins your appetite for it. Yeah. I reckon it's... I think it's going if I do. You reckon where? I reckon it's second from bottom if I have to. Yeah, but I reckon it's better. Than Personally, all the, I reckon it's better than all the ones that are on there. Yes, I'd put the top of that. Do I think it's better than Peroni? No. If it lets me swap, let me have a look. No, not better than Peroni. Uh, it's better than uh, the Desperados, the Nelson, and the Coco. Uh, that's right. <laughs> Definitely. <Yeah. laughs> You're, 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 cutting up, you're cutting up on mine. I don't know if anyone else can... I don't know whether it's me or if it's Discord, but it seems to be cutting oh. up. Do you want to just quickly try leaving Discord call and coming back? Just a quick, on a quick one. Yeah, sure. All right, Josh, all right, guys, we've kicked Josh now. Josh is done, so it'll just be me from here. Oh, he's back. Um, <laughs> right, wait, say something. Are we here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that, that seems pretty clear to know. Yeah, it was just really weird. I didn't know if it was just me. Um, yeah. But I think, yeah. So, Australia, Estrella, whatever we're calling it, if I have to, when in Spain, feel the pain. Right, I had nothing there. No bars. What's the next one? I've seen that beer before, but I can't make out what that it is. It's Amstel. Oh, it is Amstel. No, I'm sorry. No, Amstel's down. Amstel is down. I've never seen, I've never had it in the bottle, which is why I'd, I think I didn't recognise it. But I've had it on draft enough because it's the cheapest pint. It was the cheapest pint in Malmo and it was horrible. So it's either a very low if I have to or I'd rather drink my own piss. I'm not, I'm not accepting it. See, see, I, think a, I think it's a decent bev. Oh, no. no. I do think it's a decent bev. I do. No. Based oh. on that, it's got, be, uh, it's, got, it's, got, it's got to be above Estrella. Come on. Yeah. Oh, I, I'm happy with that. Like, Cause it has to be. To be fair, it depends how many you have. The first, if you, if we're talking about, yeah. we're having one sip or one pint or one bottle of these beers. You know, this is how we're grading it. Yeah. If we're talking like, oh, two, three, four of these beers. Long and out. Fuck me on I the fourth can, yeah. one. It, on the fourth one, it's gonna taste like brew dog. Like it's gonna fucking. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? There's a bit of context, yeah, guys. With everything, we need context. But I think that's fair. That's fair. I think it's not as good yeah. as Brony. I think that would be unfair. No. Right. Next Look one we got is. Asahi. I can't say I've ever we, had it. Mate, it is for pretentious fucks. Yeah, that's, that's why I've not had it. They like, if you walk to the bar and out of everything that you pick an Asahi, man, you are probably uh, a massive fucking Tory I think, who I, lives off their mum and dad's bank account. Oh, uh, now that you're saying this, it's like I've seen, I've seen it somewhere. And I wouldn't say I've been with people that have ordered it. I've been somewhere where I've seen people order it. But wagon where... Mamas. You've been Wagon Mamas. What is... what, wagon... I don't go Wagon Mamas. So I don't know why people are so excited about Wagon Mamas. It's just not... I'd rather go Nando's than Wagon Mamas. So it's... 
Wagamon was eight so, hit for me. For me, this is at the very bottom of of uh, if I have to. It oh, doesn't get any. It... Yo, yo, Mike, welcome in. Silly plonker in chat. He be yo, choppy. He be choppy. Me. Choppy. Are you on about Josh? Kind of choppy. I don't <laughs> I... know if it was me. I do be chopping. Yeah, I've not had it before, so I'm willing to. I'm willing to take your word on it. If it was something that was decent, it would have. I would have been exposed to it by now. So for that logic alone, it has to go at the very bottom for me. Like something has to prop okay, up the table. Fair yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah. Um, no, 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 no. I think it is the top. I think if you had it, you would rather drink it over Heineken and salt, personally. Yeah. Knowing you and how you are. Yeah. We'll leave. So we'll leave it there until I've had it. I'll probably try it at some point. I don't want to yeah. buy it though. If anyone wants to buy me it, then I'll have it. It's one of them. And like, I'd rather. It's one of those beers. Like some beers are nice oh, yeah, if you sure. don't buy them, but if you have to pay for them, it's like don't taste as nice. Right. Speaking of tasting nice, beer Moretti. Beer Moretti. We've got the Murray. Oh yes. On on hand. Oh yes. No Moretti. Moretti it's gotta is, be elite. It's minimum elite. Now like, I'd, ha I'd, have it, I'd, I'd have it over Corona. Yes. Yeah. San Miguel though, is so nice, so tasty. How can a beer be tasty but San Miguel can? Hashtag not sponsored. <sighs> I think it's got. To... I think it's got to be elite. It? It's got to be. Yeah, better than Corona. It's got to be. Is it? It's got to be top of it. Oh, this is going to annoy me. Why has this one not got white space? And all the others do. Yeah. Fucking little show off with no white I space. Think this is Lager. No, I don't think it's as good as Lost Lager, personally. Nah, Sani Mig. Sani Mig has to... Sani Mig is Arsenal. This is Beer Moretti's like... like... It's like how Liverpool are nowadays. It's good. It's reliable. It is good. It's fucking good. <clears throat> I'm happy with it there. I don't think it goes any yeah, higher or any lower. Definitely yeah, not any lower. Yeah. I don't know. That's fair. Definitely fair. Right. Is that Brooklyn? Uh, Brooklyn Pilsner. Brooklyn Pilsner? I think it's... I don't think I've had the Pilsner. I've had the... It's, it's, it's fucking dog shit. It's awful. It's horrific. I mean... It's, it's fucking... Looking at other pilsners I know, which is only about like Carlsberg, then I'm not really a fan of Carlsberg personally. Obviously, we'll get on to Carlsberg, but yeah, no, Bro Brooklyn beer, ah, honestly, I couldn't really say. Like, I, I, it's definitely, it. it's not a get decent beer. Stick it at the bottom. Yeah. Stick it at the bottom. Uh, uh. Can we just put, can we just put Bud Light there as well? Do we even need to go into hey, that one? So, Oh, no. Okay, no, so so I threw this in there for You've one reason, one You've reason only. Go for it. Beer pong. Bud Light is the best beer for beer pong. So we're putting and it. What it you're saying on, is. Well, on that alone, I'd rather be at the top of drink my own piss or bottle some. That's what I'm saying. It's top, it of, is, top of it the bottom. It is elite for beer pong. Yeah, yeah, definitely. It's the slimmest bird at Weight Watchers. Ah. You're still fat. Yeah. So it's... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is. Oh, shit. I didn't... I didn't oh, it, right. it goes there. So I think that's about... Yeah. That's about fair, to be honest. Um, one sec, I just need to do something. Let me just do something. Um, mute that completely. I'm trying to work out why your audio is doing what it's doing, but hopefully it fixes itself. Right, so we've had Bud doing Light. Oh, what's it doing? Is it like uh, cutting up? You sound, yeah. It, it. I don't know if it's Discord. It sounds okay now, so let's just hope. Hopefully, it continues. Mm -hmm. Um, we've had right. Bud Light. Now we've got um Budweiser. I now, don't say it. I think Bud Light. I really do. I, I've never had a good pint of Budweiser purely because. Bud Light is one of the only beers that goes through it, its own system in a pub. So, because obviously Thomas, you work in a bar as well, right? Yeah. So Budweiser on draft has to go through one cooler and then go through a secondary flash cooler. 
yeah. come out. Otherwise, you can't serve it. That's just like their rules, basically. Uh, because of that, room. no fucker wants to put it on time. Fucking, fucking long. Yeah. I think it's shit. I think it's shit. The bottles Yo, are shit. Scott, what's up, man? The bottles are so bad. Yo, Scott, thank you for the follow. Yeah, the bottles are so bad. I would bad. put it under Bud Light, personally. You put it under Bud Light? Yeah, straight up. I, I would rather drink a pint of Bud Light. I was literally going to say, I'll put it on the same level as Heineken. So, like, basically, yeah. yeah. I mean, Budweiser or Heineken, I couldn't choose between them because they're both equally yeah. shit, in my opinion. Yeah. Right. Carlsberg. Okay. Carlsberg. This is not bottom of the list and the list is fucked. Carlsberg is the worst. It's horrible. Fuck it. For me. It is horrible. It is, is fucking horrible. It is the rat piss of beers. It is disgusting. And if you drink it, get yourself fucking checked into fucking alcoholic. It's not a deal. Straight yeah. up. Carlsberg, yeah. It don't come no more straight than that. Yeah, no, Carlsberg's dead. Dead last Hey, Aye, 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 aye. It is horrible. Hey, aye, aye, aye. We just look at chat. So Scott, Scott got respect on... Right, uh, got put some respect on Asahi. Right, Scott, Look, hit, uh, Scott, hit me up. I unreal. said I said that I've never had it before. So I was going completely with Josh on this one. He said that if you're a posh Tory, that's what you drink. So you basically just called Scott a Very posh true. Tory. <laughs> Scott, no, no, but, uh, okay, so... so I'm hoping this is the Scott that I know. This is the who Scott, is like you know. my boy. This is Scott, this is Scott yeah. yeah. Yeah, then Scott, bruv, you know better. Do better with yourself, man. You are not ordering a pint of Asahi on a fucking night out. Not a chance. Not yeah, but, a fucking chance. But not, not all beers are on a night out. Like we've said, some beers are like, listen, sun's out, guns out, buns out, beers <laughs> in. Like, okay, right, which is down. Okay, but, but, but can you create me a setting where you're going to order it? A fucking Asahi. Um, I've just come out of the House of Commons. Um, you just come out of Belmarsh because you've <laughs> yeah. been done for nonsense. Belmarsh yeah. prison, yeah. Is that wait? <laughs> I've just come out of Belmarsh, right? And yeah, no, I'm tired of uh, me nonsense. I need a nice cold drink. Yeah. I'm gonna have a fucking Asahi. Great, good, good, good for See, you. He's saying to have it with an Indian, but no. we. We both no, you don't have cobra. it with a fucking Indian, bro. You don't have it with an Indian. You have a cobra. There's no way you are picking a Sahi well, over even, cobra. Even Tiger, you'd have over yeah. a Sahi. Yeah, hundred percent. Shut up, Scott, man. You're trying to shit. No, to fa- I get it though. I've never, I've never had it. So someone, I'd... Scott, if we cross okay. paths again, you have to get me an Asahi, and then um, we will we will revise this list. This list will obviously right. be revised okay. at some okay. point. Okay. Okay. In which case. Podcast next week. The beer of next week's podcast is going to be Asahi. Okay. Right? I have to find it. We have to see if they say If they don't sell it in Lidl, then we're trekking into town and we're having a look. Tesco should do it, hopefully. Great. Yeah. Okay. Right. Even though I can't next see the logo, I can see the iceberg. Call. I can see the iceberg. That is cause. And when the, ice, and when the well. iceberg is blue, that means that uh, the beer is cold. Yo, Gavin... What, Where's all this Asahi, Josh? Uh, have you made me... Are you trying to get me cancelled? Everyone say... Everyone say this, brother. guys. Everyone... Sick, anyone it's coming in... <laughs> anyone coming in now? I have said... I put my hands up. I've never had this beer before in my life. I was trusting Josh's judgment Crap. on this. He's saying it is dead. He's saying it's bottom of the barrel. Literally. It is dead. You lot are saying it ain't bad. It uh, I don't know, you know. I can't... Oh, I actually hey. saved or downloaded something. Uh, anyway. Um... Uh, Scott said, what's the beer this week? So Thomas hasn't been following the beer of the week. Last week, it was Madre. I just drink, just San, Miguel. I just drink San Miguel every week. Uh, this week, we're on the Moretti. Good shit. Um, guys, so let me get through the San Miguel's tonight, not. and then we'll, we'll start. We'll buy, we'll buy some more beers. But guys, it's like, if it ain't broke, personally, like, San Miguel for oh, me is it. like, I drink it all the time, but I appreciate, you know, in like a sort of you know, our list. If it was my list, a bit of bias would kick in and San Miguel would be up there. But I'd say San Miguel is an elite beer. It's so right, I'm going to quickly pop toilet. Hang on. That's all right. Isn't beer, what, beer Moretti in Australia basically the same thing? Nah, I wouldn't say so. I wouldn't say so. I, I've seen your first... Me- Wait, 
only had it. You've only had um, Asahi at Asian restaurants. That's what we were saying about Cobra. So Cobra, you order, you get a cheeky little curry, get some Papa Doms, you know, get your lamb booner, prawn booner, all the booners. Crack open a beer. Now like, he's pissed, man. You, you, you lot, you lot have upset him. <laughs> you lot have upset him. Last week we had Kaito Nolan dropping from fucking. Dropping from her child for getting drunk. I've got Josh walking off the podcast. Mental. But I've never had... Um, I've never had Asahi. I don't even know if I'm saying it right. That's the thing. Am I saying it right? Asahi? Asahi? So where's Estrella on the list? Estrella, we put it as if I have to. We put it as if I have to. Moretti's, Moretti's a lot better than Estrella, in my opinion. I think... I just don't think I've had very good experiences of Estrella. Um... Beer Moretti, I've never had a complaint. I've never had a bad part of Moretti. Whereas Estrella, I have. So I guess that could skew it for me. Um, but I don't think Josh was too keen on it either. So we kind of just... Yeah, we, we put it there. It's on the upper end. Obviously, we'll look at the list at the end. I can't... Man, I can't see well either. This list is fucking... The bottles are all fucking tiny. I'm like, what the fuck is that? So we put Estrella, if I have to. If you bought me an Estrella, Gavin, I would drink it. Where's the Fosters? Oh, he forgot Fosters, to be fair. He was asking what beers he forgot. So, yeah, Fosters... We can, we can do bonus beers as well. We can do bonus beers. So, after we've done the list, we can... I don't know how quick it is to download the picture and put it on here, but we can see where Fosters would stack up as well because Scotty, Boy, uh, Scotty uh, Boy's pointed out the Fosters. Okay, so, to be fair... Um, Gavin, you can't say that. Fair, I, Why are you baiting me out To be like fair... That? No, no, to be fair, I think it was on there, but I think it was the wrong image format, so it... Oh, it didn't, it didn't you know, do it, yeah. Um, okay, so of course, what are we saying? What are we saying? What are we saying, Carl? I think Shit, my audio died. Hang on. No, 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 I can, I can hear you, hang I can on. hear you. Sorry, I was hang just on, taking a very, on. I was taking a very long pause, because it's like... It's, it? it's cause, man, nah, deep sigh. I don't okay. like it. I don't like it. Chat, what do we think? I think, it's, I think it's better than Bud Light. Oh, but yeah, but my fucking piss is better than Bud Light. Are we drinking a beer and random? No, no, no. We should have done that. Why did we do that? We should have bought one of each beer. All 26 beers and tried them. We're just I think doing... it has to go in. I think it has to go in. If I have to. I think it, I think it has to. I think it goes... Fuck, man. I don't like this. I don't like this. We need professional streams. This, this is, is, this this is, this is professional, professional streams. This is very professional. Um, I would have it to... below Stella. No, it's... I'll put it this way. I'll put it I would drink it over over Desperados. I would drink it. I reckon, right, in the middle then. In the middle. So it's like, yeah, that's fair. on the same... Why is that one black as, like... What, no white um, white space as well. Hey, yo, someone clip that out of context. What the why, hell? Why are you trying to Jesus that, Christ. <laughs> what did he say? What the hell? You can't say that. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> I prefer, uh, not, to, I prefer not to speak. I prefer not to speak. <laughs> right, we got Cruz Campo next. Um, I, yeah, uh, again, I, this is another one I've not had, so you guys need to let me know. Mate, Josh is just okay. trying to pull the wool over my eyes. Right. No, no, okay. So, Mike, Mike in chat, you've drank Cruz Campo in my pub. It's the latest beer I've got in. Um, I think it's a great fucking beer. It's a great beer. I really do. Um, Mike, Mike's given it three. Up. So he reckons it's a decent bev. It's a good beer. It's a good fucking beer. Um, see, look, even Scott agrees it's lovely. See, I think I think it has to go elite, but on the San Miguel because I can't put D on. So you, you've had Cruz Camper and you've had San Miguel. What one would you Mate. say is better? I would say I would say San Miguel is better, but that's only based on I've not drank enough Cruz Campo. Okay. Surely. So between Moretti, B 
Beer Moretti and Cruz Campo. Oh, no, no, I'm, I'm picking a Moretti every time. Right. Corona. Surely, surely it's better than Corona. No? <sighs> Damn, you talked this up. Nah. This is looking... No, no. No, you see, cause, because no team like that. So it's either got to be bottom of elite or top of decent, Bev. I think it goes top of decent, Bev, then, if you don't know. You would know if it was elite. Okay. Yeah, that's it, fair. I think it goes yeah, top, yeah. Of, top of decent, Bev, if it lets me yeah, swap. Yeah, that's fair. If it lets me swap. Right, Do Bex. That. Bex is shit. Shit. <laughs> Fucking awful. Fucking terrible um, beer. Terrible beer. Yeah, Most of these beers is... you picked are terrible. Look. <laughs> they're fucking mate, in the bottom mate, half. No, 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 mate, no, mate, mate. I've literally just gone for lagers that are sold in the UK. Yeah. Okay. But for me, it's better than Carlsberg. Mm. Yeah, go on. Why are you being so silent for? No, because they're, <laughs> sh- they're both shit, in it. It's like... They're, mate, they're, they're both mate. bad. Yeah, but it, no one likes Carlsberg. No one. No one. No, Carlsberg is bad. Uh, what we got next? Carling. Little, wait, wait, little little detour. Oh. Real question. Bex or Bex Blue? Oh, God, mate. Bex, have you ever tried the Bex Blue? Fuck me. That is ropey, man. That is fucking mate, ropey. My mate was moving... Um, He was moving out of his accommodation. And... He was like, oh, I've got some Bex Blue left over if you want it, because I know you're still um, I'm still in Loughborough for a couple of weeks. Gave me it, and fuck me, it was it was horrible. It turned into a beer pong drink. Like, it was basically yeah. a beer pong drink. Right. Uh, what did Scott say? Scott said, I feel Stella needs to be at least decent, unreal out of a glass. Yeah, that's the thing. Okay. Though, it's like, there's so uh, much context with so many of these beers. It's like, are we just. It's getting... our list, Scott. It's our list. Oh, Get fuck. your own list, all right? Fuck you, no. <laughs> Man's had a few too many Stellas. He's going to start yeah. throwing hands. Yeah, exactly, no. bro. To be fair, I'm going to fucking spark him up in a minute. How am I getting yo, all what these followers? The hell? What the fuck? Oh, um, God, no. We've been botted. What the fuck? How do I stop oh, it? Oh, God, no. Oh, God, no, we've been botted. How do we stop it? <laughs> what the fuck? We're being regret- okay, What the we- hell? If we-, if we put Stella... No, no. Scott said if we put Stella to decent... Right, Stella's decent now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Change it, change it, change it. Change it, it to decent. It stopped, change it stopped. It stopped, it stopped. Uh, it stopped. There we go, it worked. It, it stopped. There we go, it's, it's stopped. Perfect, we put- perfect. We put Stella to decent. Cheers, Scott. All-, all right, Scott, we get it. We get it, man, we get it. Scott came in, Scott came in with the pot. Christ. Right, we put Stella to decent. Are you happy? Because, like I was saying, okay. like some of these beers in bottles, they're rank, but on draft, yeah. they are very nice. So it's you and Gav, a special guest. We can make that happen. We can make that happen, and we can. Mate, like we, mate said, we can make that happen. We can we make that happen. We can revise this list. And speaking of special guests, oh fucking hell, more bots. I was gonna say, look at the. Oh god, we put Stella to again. fucking decent. Leave us alone, man. This has never happened to me. Does this mean I've, does this mean we've made it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's it. Man. We're, we're good. We're good. Jesus want, Christ. But I don't want all these bots following me. It's going to... Fuck my numbers up. <laughs> fuck, you know. You're going viral? Right. I fucking hope not. Right. All, all we did was put Stella in, if I have to, and now we're getting fucking brigaded. <laughs> <laughs> it will suck, because all these accounts will get banned in the future. Yo, Tyler, welcome in. Yeah. That's the thing. Then I won't know when I actually have like a certain milestone of followers. Yo, can we get a shout out for Tyler Bowling in chat? An actual account, not a fucking bot. Yeah. Jesus Christ, man. Right, right. Let's, get, right. let's get back right. to the beers. Right. I'm, not even looking, I'm not even looking at OBS now because oh. I need to be on browser to move all this. Right, we were on Carlin. If you asked me this a few years ago, I'd be talking the most shit. I'd be saying, oh, Carlin, it's a decent bev. It's this, it's that. I think it's the top end of if I have to, personally. Yep. Oh, I would agree. A few years ago, I'm, I'm talking the most. Have you ever had a Carling Black Fruits? Oh, mate. Carling Dark Fruits is yeah. good, brother. Like, it's, it's like fuck nice. knows where these guys went wrong in their in their lager like brewing because their Dark Fruits is fucking... You know fully they just, you know fully they just robbed it off of fucking... Strong wait, 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 wait. Hang on. Hang on. 
we're not putting this at top of if I have to. There's no fucking way. There's no way you're picking a, a calling of an Amstel. No, no, no. That's Drop just, that shit down one That's place. literally what we just said. And you were like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God. God, we're getting botted again. Look, oh, no. see what you've done, bro. I did, all right, all right. Okay, okay, man. Fuck you, no. Right, yeah, below change Amstel, that shit, bro. Boys, I'm going to keep from going. <laughs> Jesus Christ. But Amstel and Carlin are both about the same for me, so I'm, I'm, I'm okay with that. Fucking hell, man. Right. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fucking hell, bro. bro. Congrats on the 1,000 subs. Thousand followers, man. Let's go. No, that's bullshit. I didn't even have six hundred. No, that's fucked up my follower goal. Now I'm gonna have to fucking reset oh. it. Pain. Car no, Carling is. Pain. That's. Do you reckon Carling is decent? That's why, Gavin. I was trying to say it's on top of if I have to. Personally. It's not decent, though, is it? It's not decent. This is fucking up my number. Oh, I'm so annoyed. How do we stop this right, bot shit? On. There it's should right. be. This is cap, man. No, I'm just watching the bots coming. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. There needs to be a way I can make this stop. One sec. Um, I don't think there is. All right, no, I'm going to keep it. And then we're going to see my stream summary afterwards. My stream summary yeah, afterwards. Yeah, just... I'm, my, my follower increase. But the thing is, all that happens <laughs> now, Nightbot's going to go ham as well because these are all lines in the chat. Yeah. That's going to fuck it up. Right. What's the next one? Cronenberg. Cronenberg. Uh, I don't know, you know. Cronenberg is a shit stellar. Cronenberg is a shit stellar. Yeah, well, I had Cronenberg because it was one of the only beers I recognised when I was in Lithuania. And it... It wasn't nice. I put it on... Mate, I Cronenberg it, is for proper piss edge, brother. Like... I, I'll put it below cause, above, uh, above Cobra. Yeah... Or it's yeah, either that, yeah. or it's like probably just after Soul. I'd rather drink my own piss. Like they're all bad. Yeah. I, I reckon. I, oh, I reckon okay. it after after cause. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, uh, let's chef, go. Purely tall lost lager, not yeah, just, not Brewdog as a whole. Just lost lager. So obviously, with a lot of just these, lost lager. a lot of these guys, it's like not just the brand. It's like the actual. The actual beer as well, because obviously Brooklyn have got a few different beers. They've got yeah. pills and everything, so it's yeah. Obviously, there's going to be some bias in here, but it's no fun about but right. Madri, we're back to the Spanish beers. Oh, brother, this is nectar of the gods. This is the this is the best recently released beer. Yeah, for no. years, if it years be, and years, and if, it slaps between. So when they were talking about getting rid of San Miguel at my pub, I wouldn't have been that mad because we had um, we had Madri. So if they got rid of San Miguel, I think I'd drink Madri and love it just the same. So I, I can agree with that. If anything, I think I like Madri. If I like Madri more, but everywhere I go, San Miguel's cheaper. So <laughs> I like Madri more than I like Murray. I like up. I like San Miguel more, but um, Madri's probably Madri's probably better. It's a Fuck it, it's so good. Second, guys, so I'm good. Back, I'm going to back these down a bit. Blinding Gavin, he's only an old man. Right, there we go. Um, yeah, no, to be fair, between, between like, we'll keep Brewdog out of it because it's very different to the other three that I'm going to mention. Yeah. But Moretti, San Miguel, and Madri, very nice. Very, very nice. I'm sure you lot are going to send me loads Fuck of pictures good. of Barcelona with your Madri. You know, the guy looks like the fucking professor from what's his face. Yeah. Um, <laughs> oh, what is it called? Uh, money heist. Looks like the money heist professor. The Spanish one. Um, what, we got, what we got next? Camden, Camden Hells. Hells. Oh, Camden Hells. Yeah. It's a decent bev, bro. That is I a decent is, bev. I think it's better than. I think it's decent. The thing is. Um, Oh, if we're talking better than Stella, are we talking better than Stella on draft or in a bottle? Because I reckon it's better than Stella in a bottle. I reckon it goes underneath Stella if we're talking just overall. Like there. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, we'll take that. Yeah. Fair. Right. Red Stripe. Was this Jamaican Lager? Okay. This is the only competition for Carlsberg. The worst beer. This is a festival. Like, look, if you look at all the others, most of them are bottles. Apart from the yeah. Carlin, this is the only other tinny. So, but as far as tinnies goes, this is still like fucking dog shit tier. So I reckon. 
I'd rather you, drink red stripe than call him. Better. I'd rather drink red stripe than call him. You mean calling or Carlsberg? Oh, Carlsberg, sorry, yeah. Yo, Scott, thank you for the prime sub. Um, yeah, yes, I'd, I agree. I'd, I'd rather I'm drink red stripe than Carlsberg. Do you know drink red stripe than Bex? Yes. And then that's it. Okay. I'd rather drink red stripe than those two. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. I wouldn't uh, like. I'd rather. Uh, Scott, I'd rather you... Got a dip, boys. Yeah, no, I appreciate you, man. Thank you for the. Thank you for the stuff. Can it go below? Honestly, if there was a below one, then it, it would yeah, be there. It would be there. What's this star? Pra oh, star Praman. I do like a good star Praman. I have to admit, it's minimum for me. It's minimum decent. Minimum decent. I've only tried it once, but I think it was a bad point. So oh, had, I see the hype around it. Star Prime and, so, uh, I, I had it in Prague, which is obviously it's a you know it's a beer from Prague, so it's nice. So but I'm willing to accept decent. I think it's better than I'd have it personally better than Stella, but I'd be happy either side of Stella. Okay, well, th this one is completely your call, and I'll I'll, I'll, I'll follow you on this. I, one. I I have it above Stella because when I've gone. I've gone out, like, I've met people that make birthdays, gone bowling, and I'm like, oh, they've done Star of Praman. I'll go out of my way to, because weirdly enough, not a lot of places have it on tap, like, compared to Stella, yeah. for instance. Yeah, so, no, yeah. I think yeah, that yeah. makes me appreciate it more, but I reckon there's not much in it between Stella and Star of Praman. Guys, you can, obviously, you guys in chat will have your opinions, but your opinions ain't mean shit. Our list. Our fucking list. Right. Is that Praha? It's, like, cut off. Prava, yeah. Yeah. Have you um, had Prava? Yeah, yeah, I've had it before. Um, when there's no star, I'm gonna Prava, say it, man. I'm gonna what? say it, bro. I what? think it's elite. I think it's an elite can beer. I think it is beautiful. I think I've never had a bad pint. I think it's better than. I don't know, you know, because I really like Star Pramen, so I don't know if I'd even have it above Star Pramen. I think it's at least a decent bev. I'm happy to put it. Because I've never had the first one oh. a decent bev either. I've, I've, I'm happy to put it above Peroni. But I, I yeah, I've, okay, I've, that's I, fair. I've not had the... I don't even know the name of the other one who had a Peroni. What's the one yeah, that's Peroni? Fair. Uh, Cruz Campo. That's it. I've never had that, so I don't know what it's like compared to that person. I can help, man. We're going to have some beers to get in for next week, yeah? Right. I'm happy with it going there. I'm happy with Perfect. it going there. Right. Let's have a look at this now, like... As a, as a whole, a look. let's see if there's anything where it's like, how the fuck have you got there? Right, we start from. We should probably start from the bottom because there's more at the bottom. So yeah, so so I think honestly, I think the bottom is as good as it's gonna be. I I, I think it's pretty spot on, to be honest. Tier list or shopping list, both, um, both both. Yeah. Um, is there anything that we'd want to reshuffle on the bottom row? You know, do we think Carlsberg's better than anything? No. Bex? No, hell no. So the bottom three are like, nah. you know, the relegation ones. Like, they're all going down anyway. So it doesn't matter if you go down in 12th oh, yeah, straight you go up, down yeah. in 18th. Like, you're done. You're in the championship. Actually, you know, you're in fucking same league as like hashtag. Oh, you're right. done, man. Yeah. Fucking whatever league hashtag you're in. Step, step fucking six or whatever. Um, right. Brooklyn... I don't drink it enough, you know, but there's probably a reason for that. The other thing is, I, I would maybe put Brooklyn over Seoul. You'd put Brooklyn on the top of the... Rather drink my own piss. Over Seoul, yeah. But so, yeah, Seoul's on the top. Seoul's on the top of that tier. United versus so. Newcastle, round four. That's a big round four. I think so. Also, I do... I knew Arsenal were winning against Burnley. You'd put it at the top of that tier. I'm okay with that, to be fair, because I'm not a fan of any of those. Um, yeah. Like, if I had to probably drink one, like, if I had a choice, if you were like, I'm buying you a beer and it has to be one of these on the bottom, um, I'd probably just ask you to buy me Soul. But but they're all bad, so I'd like to think you wouldn't offer me any they of those. They are all bad. <laughs> they're all shit. They're all fucking shit. Um, how did Arsenal get on? I didn't even see the end. Oh, we won 1-0 in the end against Brentford. That's not too bad. 
Who did Arsenal yeah, get? Then, let, me, let me know, let me know. West Ham, oh, that's big, that is. West Ham, Arsenal, maybe another trip to London Stadium. Um, okay, so rather drink my own piss. I'm, ha- I'm happy with that. I don't Solid, think anything yeah. else should drop down there. Oh, no. Right, next one. If I have to. If I have to. Do I have to? Let's have a look. Um, I'm still calling Estrella, Cause, Prolenberg, Desperados, Cobra, Sahi. Don't think I'm happy with Esparta's being that high, if I'm honest. You'd put... Mm, I wouldn't drop it down a tier. I'd arguably put... Cause I wouldn't drop it down a tier. I'd rather. Put, I'd arguably put Cause ahead of it. I don't know if I'd put... Yeah. Mick Cronenberg ahead of it. Oh, no, no, definitely not. So we can swap those two. I think Cause has to be ahead, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Surely. Cobra stays at the bottom. Cronenberg, shit yeah. as well. Desperado, there's just better. Like, between Desperado, Corona, and Soul, it's like people probably think Desperado's, like, decent because they don't like Soul. But if Corona didn't exist, then you'd say Desperado's decent. So it's just one of those yeah. things. It's all in relation. That's what I think, personally, anyway. Um, the top three in that, for me, personally, there's nothing between Amstel and Carlin. And I think I just enjoy... The other Spanish beers a lot better to, you know. Yeah, definitely. I don't drink a yeah. lot of Estrella, so. Yeah, I agree. I mean, I'm I'm happy with that one. I don't think any of them should drop yeah. down, and none of them should none of them should go up into decent bev, in my opinion. Decent right. bev, we've got Cruz Campo, Prava, Peroni, Sara Praman, Stella, and Camden Hells. The thing is, me personally, I'd like to fight. Star Problems Corner a bit more and try and nick it a place, but I think generally speaking, Peroni probably is a better beer. I would just rather drink Star Problems, so I'm 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 happy leaving it in sort of the middle. And I, to be fair, mate, I agree that I'm happy to swap them a place. Yeah, all right. Star Problems, right? So what about Star Problems and, and Prava? Is that mate? Bad? I just think Prava's better. I, I do. I do I think, think it's better. Too fair, like. Prava and Star Prama is the same for me as like Amstel and Carlin. It's like I'm not really too fast, you know. If you offer me the one, problem I'm... I have with Star Prama, yeah, it's too thick, man. It's too thick to it drink. Was, it was so weak. Hey, yo, thick boys, <laughs> thick boys. But no, literally. Yeah. I, I mean, I'll, I'll have to. I mean, we definitely have to try a uh, Cruz Campo and let yeah. me know what you think because for sure, for I sure. think you'll quite enjoy it. Yeah, we will. Um, we'll have to make it happen. Uh, on bevs, elite. None of them. Decent bevs are staying where they are. None of them are elite level. And none of them are if I have to. I think they're... I yeah. think we wouldn't mind spending Yo. money on any of those beers. Yo, Mamita God. with the raid of 72 Mamita viewers. Mamita with the raid. Thank you for the follow, Welcome guys. Welcome in. Welcome in, raiders. Um, We've got a lot of followers now because we got botted. So it's nice to have some real... Real followers and real viewers. Real people coming in, man. Real ones in chat. Yo, Momo, how was your stream? First time chatter as well. How was your... I saw... I'll I think, come in. I think you were ranked 17 when I had a look before we went live. How was the How was the climb? Let me drop a shout out real I'll quick. Drop the little refresh command. We're literally just sort of... We're just overseeing and overviewing the little beer tier list we've got going. We're trying to make some adjustments where where necessary but obviously there's going to be an element of bias in any of these tier lists you see like you see them for like gbl mons and all stuff like that but we're doing them on cool things we're doing them on beers and obviously you know there are some beers that we've put at the bottom that might be your favorite beer but they're just not ours so no offense but those beers are shit yeah oh dark they, they welcome in as well welcome in everyone got some followers got welcome some into the podcast uh, for anyone who is just joining now from that big raid, this is uh, mine Thomas's podcast. I booze you. Um, yeah, welcome in. Hope you guys stick around and yeah, enjoy the content. We got some, some more stuff to talk about. We just finished our beer tier list, as Thomas said, um, and it is the old beer list, by the way. What's that? Oh, sorry, you cut off the ultimate. Yeah, yeah. This is the one, the one beer list. Straight out. The one, the one. Is it, 
It all, Perfect. All, all beer tastes like beer to my mouth. So the, this, he's looking at this. <laughs> he's looking at this list like, huh? Like, all this, all this tastes the same to me. Now, to be fair, I like. I remember, like, were you ever at a stage? How old do you think you were when you realised that, like, you didn't mind beer? You know what I'm saying? Like, when you grow up and it's like you try a beer and you're like, oh, yucky beer. Or did you just have your first sip of beer and you were like, hmm, like, like, fucking, what, 12 years old? Mate, I mean, to be fair, for me, the first alcoholic drink I drank when I was 18 was a pint of John Smith's when I lived up north. And it was fucking beautiful. Loved it. Fucking okay, no. hell. Yo, liability. Okay. Thank you. For, thank you for the follow. Josh is a liability as well, so you have that in common. Um, I drank hey, beer yo. to get drunk when I was a teenager. Fair enough. Fair enough. Now, See, when me... I was a teenager, it was always cider or the vodka from uh, from Aldi. Oh God, Aldi vodka. Yeah. So like the little vodka they have, it's like the the knockoff Smirnoff vodka, right? It's called like Rach... yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Ra- Rachmininov. Like there's fucking there's some random fucking. Yeah. off-brand supermarket <laughs> shit it's yeah, petrol man it. petroleum like you drink when you're a student like i was, yeah, it was like, it. that was like you were holding that like a bottle of grey goose you were there like <laughs> in photos like you were going mad but that's Amazing. not the one but to be fair Amazing. right back to the list i think i'm happy with the top five so the, the three elite beers sam yeah. my boy sam miguel had to be there and i so I've usually got good taste in most things. So I'm happy with San Miguel being on the top of Elite. Corona. They're going to Europe. They're going to Europe. These three boys. They are going to Europe. Yeah. They, they didn't quite make the uh, top. Yeah. Uh, okay, so liability says, what are the parameters for this list? Are there no craft beers in England? So this is purely for lager. Yeah. Um, This list. Um, I'm quite a fan of craft beer. Myself, that will probably be a list for another day. Yeah, there's just um, so, so yeah, many. Yeah, there's quite a few. There's so many. There's so many beers that you have on cask and craft as well. Like, there, there, there's a lot. But like these, just because the pictures, so like the Stella and the Peroni, obviously you can get them as pints on draft as well, um, on tap for people that might not know what draft means or draft beer means. Um, so we're kind of just judging them, you know, yeah. generally speaking, even though the picture shows a bottle or shows a can, we're just judging them as a as a yeah. liquor, you know, as a liquid, how nice it tastes. And obviously there's a lot of context to be to be added with a lot yeah. of these beers. So just bear that in mind as well, guys. Please please don't hate us. We had Scott hating on us just yeah. now and now he's gone, yeah. so we're we're fit we're free of judgment. Yeah. Uh thanks a lot, uh Mamita for the raid. Appreciate that. Have a great rest of your evening. Um, uh, liability if we're talking that based on this tier list I can think of one quote unquote craft beer slash IPA that would top this list say it uh, Uh, I think neck oil would top this list oh neck oil neck oil is very nice but are we yeah Neck oil looked like it pours out like a lager, and like I had neck oil. What's well, other... IPA in it? I I had neck oil the other day when I think I got like a free drink on like my season ticket app. Uh, I tried I had a neck oil, got the funky little psychedelic skull glasses. Neck oil is lovely, but yeah, like cool. to be honest, yeah, it's like fine. it's always expensive, but it's a good beer. It is a very good, a good beer. If, if you're someone yeah, that don't mind beer. how much you spend on alcohol or booze or whatever, then it's definitely one worth getting. But between it will probably be up on nectar of the gods on this list whether it will be ahead of brew dog yeah. and madri maybe maybe uh, i think if, i think it's a beer for a different kind of occasion yeah for definitely definitely but i'm happy but, with the top two being as they are sure man okay but, oh yeah, shit, yeah i think go on sorry keep going no no go on man Karen, you... i was gonna say when you yeah. went these are we're talking about fosters yeah. so any bonus beers? Any serious omissions that we've missed? How do I... I'm going to have a look. Is there a quick way... Oh, no, you're the editor. Are you able to... Nah, yeah, no, I can't. I, I can't add it in. I'd have to re-upload it. That's fine. I think... Fosters would go at top of... If I have to, for me personally. Yeah, I think... I'd... Mm, I don't know if I'd put it ahead of Amstel... They're about the same, though, for me. Like, Amstel, yeah. Fosters, and Carlin, 
no different for me. I reckon I'd put Foster's yeah. on like the same right. level as Carlin. So just in that sort of high end of if I have to. If someone bought me, I would drink it. So oh, my ability okay. says uh, I like a good lager now and then. But growing up in Oregon, IPA for me. Cost as a mark, I'll keep that one in mind. So, like Billy, what I will say is, if you are coming to England, you have to try neck oil. And if you get the chance, get yourself down to a brew dog. I think brew dog do great craft beer. Um, and there's a there's quite a big upcome in England at the minute for craft beers in general, like little tap rooms. Yeah. So yeah, you can definitely definitely find some good ones. Definitely. Yeah, for sure, for sure. But I literally like what we'll say neck oil. Beaver Town Neck Oil, as it's fully called. Go, it just goes down. like It's quite refreshing as well. You know, some beers are quite heavy or, like, quite, you know, not bitter, but, like, have a weird aftertaste. If yeah. anything, brew, like, I say, keep saying Brewdog, man. I've got Brewdog on my mind. Beaver Town Neck Oil, just, it's refreshing. And not many Good. beers are actually quite refreshing and have a nice, leave a yeah. not, nice aftertaste in your mouth, so. Well, it's quite floral, isn't it? I think. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, for sure, for sure. It's very nice. What about, um, oh, no, you know what we talk about? Craft and everything now. Where would we put Icebreaker on this list? Hypothetically. Well, drinking. Drinking Icebreaker. Oh, top, top of decent Bev. Yeah, I agree. Icebreaker. Top of decent I'm, Bev. I'm gutted we stopped doing Icebreaker, but the only reason we stopped doing Icebreaker is because we upgraded to Madry, so it was a win. But I was sad that Icebreaker had to be the one that left. Because it was yeah. either, it was either they were talking about San Miguel leaving. I was like, no, no, not that I had like um, it was my final decision, but I basically just said yeah. no, please no, and then it had to be icebreaker. Icebreaker had to go. Yeah. But icebreaker's a good pint. Yeah, it, it's I. Right. It's just drinking it. Yeah, okay. I'm not getting. So I know they pay me, but I'm not getting paid to say it's nice. It actually is nice. It's actually it's actually a decent pint. I kind of miss it really thinking about it, but um, yeah, that is it for the yeah, man. that is it for That's the tier list. Tier list. Done. That is it for the tier list. Right? Do we wanna do we wanna go into memes or do you have any? I Mate, know you said, I know you said you have some. I have stories. got some. Right. I no no no. Forget that. Right. Let me see this link. Let, let's pull this up on browser mode. We're gonna go into story time. Oh, guys, chat, all right? Now, buckle up, right? Because this is wild. Okay. But this came out just today. Literally today, a few hours ago. So, for those who, you know, probably don't know, obviously you won't. Me and Thomas take this podcast very seriously. We actually talk like quite a lot. We talk yeah. stuff, you know, stuff we want to talk about. Content, news, blah, 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 whatever. So, I had this whole, like, story that I wanted to talk about. And then I loaded up Twitter, X, whatever, and this story came out. Um, if you could pull that up on the browser screen, that would be fantastic. I'm just, I'm literally just snipping our, snipping our tier list. I know I could go back and just do it, but I'm just doing it just so I can save it. What, um, who's, where would I find it on Twitter? Uh, no, no, I've sent you on Discord. Oh, you sent Link. it to me. Okay, okay. I will, uh... Sir. I will do that now. Let me. Because this story is a madness, and I can't believe it. To be honest, like yep. fully cannot fucking believe it. Like says, all this shit out. I've had some brew dog in the states. Oregon gets almost any beer from anywhere. That sounds that sounds good to me. That sounds yeah, man. Br Br brew dog is great. Brew dog is great. Really is good. Give me a sec, guys. Let me just get it. Oh shit. Okay. Um, it's a madness. Oh, so it's, oh, this isn't Twitter. I thought you were saying it was. Oh, it was something you saw on Twitter. Yeah, 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 something I saw on Twitter. Okay. Um, we'll keep that that one there. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna uh, read this out. I actually, okay. I actually closed it because I don't like too many tabs open. Right, floor's yours. Okay, so. Pilot Mike Beaton stacked by British Airways and banned from flying after a cocaine binge before a flight. When I read this headline, bro, I'm like, there's no fucking way this is true. So oh, if you want to scroll crash. down just a little look bit. At, no, look at the time. That's 10, 10 o'clock this yeah, morning. Yeah. 
Well, that's what I'm saying. It is fucking fresh. Like when I read this. So, um, so a British Airways pilot has been sacked after a port. He snorted cocaine off a topless woman before trying to oh, fly a passenger that. plane back to London. So what we say, man's there, like, <laughs> man's got, he's, so he's got the lines out, he's got the credit card, done the little honour, and then just, what, motorboated and gone, at the same time. Straight up. Like, Straight up. And then, right, and then tried to go to work to fly a plane of 300 people fucking back home. It is a madness. So the article reads, uh, so so this pilot was married, right? Um, and one of the stewardesses on the flight raised the alarm. Yeah, I'm just going so, uh, Gavin so, saying this happened in August, but it's getting reported in September. No, no, September. September, Gav. Um, so this guy was due to fly from Johannesburg, South Africa to London. Um, he was instead flown to Heathrow as a passenger the next day because he tested positive for uh, <laughs> tested po positive for, for drug, drug use. use. Right? Yeah, no. So, okay, so this was a drug fueled incident which occurred in one of his nights off in Johannesburg. He texted his stewardess colleague <laughs> saying he was partying with two local men, a female and a young Spanish woman. Which Where you met you at a night I oh, I need to scroll down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah scroll down. down. Holy shit. So yeah, he's, yeah. He's, he's... Yeah, go on. It, it, it... It's a madness problem. So he met this group at a nightclub. So he went back to one of the guys' flat, and yep. these two Donnies have pulled out some fucking coke. Uh, he sent a text message to his colleague saying, I've lost my t-shirt somewhere. One of the local lads produces a plate with a few lines of coke. The text message said. Mental. He then said, so then there's a date about who's <laughs> chest. Is the best to bump it off. I'm just saying, brother. This is a that's wild, brother. This is a madness. This is a madness because if you are a pilot, <laughs> you are set for life, brother. You are breaded straight up. Yeah, yeah. And my man, <laughs> it's like no, no, no. It's fine. It's it's an easy day at work tomorrow. I'm flying from South yeah. Africa to London. I was like, yeah, fuck it. We, we'll get on the gear. Fuck it. Why not? I'm like, that yeah, is a madness, brother. That is normal. Like, normal. like, like, could you imagine, brother? You get on this, you get on this flight and you know the, you know the dodgy fucking little like, like, um, like, like the overhead, uh, intercoms. The pilots yeah, do. Yeah, yeah. Imagine if pilots just like, <laughs> <laughs> like, can you imagine if that happened? Oh, I don't shit. know what I'm reacting, man. Like, I'm, I'm putting the fucking child's safety belt on and everything, brother. Like, straight up. Oh, shit, man. No, no, I'm, I'm reading the rest of this article now saying that the pilot's wife has declined to comment. But what's she going to say? Like... Why wasn't I invited? Yeah, yeah, brother. She's like, oh, she's like, what the? Coast up for real. She's like, what the fuck, Mike? Like, like, you know, we we promised this. This was supposed to be our thing. Yeah. Fucking mad, yeah. absolute madness. I could not believe it when I read this. Could not fucking yeah. believe it. And then, oh, Uncle Mystic, and then imagine that. But the flight he was supposed to be flying, because of these texts. <laughs> the flight was cancelled 24 hours. So you had to explain it to those 300 people waiting for their flight. Sorry, you can't fly today because your captain's on a bit of a come down. Like yeah, he's, fucking <laughs> he's fucking coked out. Like he's absolutely fucking dunsky. I'm like, what the fuck is that? So that, so that Gavin, is a madness, brother. Ga that, that, Gavin that is said a an article from News 24, and he said the article. I've not opened the article, but he said that he said it happened in August. But even, even still, regardless even of what still, it happened, that is still that, that is, is a madness. That is a fucking don't, madness, brother. I, I, I'm reaching do under my seats. I'm getting the parachute out. I'm dropping the fucking oxygen mask, bro. I'm strapping in. I'm strapping in, bro, because I'm getting home. I'm getting home to my four wings and chips, no matter the cost, man. Don't care. Boys and girls, ladies and gents, people of all ages, don't do drugs, man. That's yeah, don't do out. coke. Don't do coke if you're a pilot, man. Don't Just do it. You can afford it. Don't Just fucking do it. it. Yo, Uncle Mystic, 
talking about beating up Mr. Avalanche. <laughs> Mental. Listen. Matt Beer as well. First of all, I refuse to comment. Yeah, I, I prefer not to speak. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Matt that's Beer, nice what's up? Shep says, don't forget that flight is... Yeah, 10 or 11 hours, brother. And my man is pinging, bro. My man is flying like this. Yeah, like the jaw is... He, 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 he needed it. Like, just gurning on the flight. Honestly, it was like... Like, so... the... The jaw is he fucking sweet. Yeah. You imagine you're he's sat there, there bro, and you're high. You imagine you've got the wheel. Yeah. And you're just like, yeah, yeah fuck it, let's just shit him up, bro. Let's just fucking shit him up every now and then. Just fucking yeah. start jolting he's it. He's there, like, fucking on the intercom, like, shit, shit, <laughs> shit. And it's like, fucking... Fucking mad, like, bro. I, I, he's fucked. I actually don't know Josh how I would react. I don't know how I Josh would react, would you? Yeah. No, I wouldn't. I'd be fucking terrified. Like, if I was uh, just a random passenger. The article says he could lift his head up after 2 p.m. the next day. <laughs> my mum was, like... my mum was bumping. He was, he was, was no, it, but oh that's my... like, he's got no, he's got no energy to do it. But like, that's a heavy, deep sense of shame. He's like, he's like, my head just stays down. My head just stays down. Happy. Surely Matt Beer is God tier on the beer list. Yes, he is. He is. But, mate... S-tier. But mate, but so he's a pilot. He's got one kid. He lives in fucking Devonshire. The fucking Tory bastard. First of all, well, my man's yeah. working in Iceland for the rest of his life. Like he's filling Shit. freezers, and like for what? For, for what? Because you, you, you know, that's why mums go to Iceland. Yeah, it's a mad. Yeah. <laughs> mums go for Iceland that's for their bumps. Yeah, man. That's why mums go to Iceland. Madness. That's why I fucking... Fucking madness. I could so not... So what was it? Was it British? And let me just read up on the article. British Airways. Yeah. The... Fuck you, yeah, no. Which what is full air, of Karen as well. Gat... Heathrow or Gatwick? Uh, Heathrow. He... Jesus. Yeah, mad, mad. Mr. Yeah. Beaton. Fucking Mr. Beaton. Unbelievable, man. Honestly, like... Mush... like God, as soon as I'm like, that is a madness. No, but it's like... There's like the fine detail, you know, articles and stuff like sometimes yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they, they they really do capture it. And oh, I yeah. think this one does. Cocaine off a topless woman for trying to fly a passenger plane back to London. Yeah. So like he just he just tried to he thinks it's alright, I can't fly the plane. I'm gonna go in the passy with my side thing and go <laughs> start like fucking snorting it off her rack. Like that's mental. Like Mr. Meme said, got okay. racks on racks. Yeah. I've just followed up. I've just checked out another version of this from uh, <laughs> from New York Post. So bear in mind, right? So the only reason why he got caught is because when he was drunk, he had um, he'd messaged his uh, one of the stewardesses on his flight. Oh no! Dude. He sent her she's snitched. She's snitched. She's Brother, he sent him a text saying, <laughs> I've been a very naughty boy. <laughs> <laughs> no. Screenshot so it didn't happen. No, no, it's That's so like... good. Hang on, I need to cut, get rid of my fucking ad blocker real quick. <laughs> that is... Mike, that, M- Mike, that's why I checked what, um, what, like, Airways it was because if it was fucking Ryanair, that's standard. But the fact that it's British Airways, <laughs> that's meant to be like sort of an upper tier sort of service funny. you're getting. But you're getting all the fucking conservative Tory cunts, right. you know, fucking doing coke off fucking random birds knockers. Like that's fucking nuts. So I tried to fly the following day. Uh, was well, not until crew reported the pilot's alarming behavior. Josh, you're cutting up a bit. I don't, I don't know if it's the same for everyone. Oh, your camera just went a bit as well. No, I'm good. I'm good. Okay, good now. <laughs> British Airways, Coke, Ryanair, it's crack. Um, Coke, Ryanair, plus crack. Mental. So he cost British Airways $120,000. He... He was then, uh, he then got suspended and his license taken away from him. He flown home as a passenger the next day, failed yep. and failed the drug test and then was fired. 
I thought he would pass personally. I think he should do better next time. He's yeah. Tried harder to pass. Like fucking men. Mate, guy. this goes deep into fucking detail, man. Straight up, like yeah, mad. But he basically finished off the text with oh, and that's the story of how I ended. That's the story of how I ended up snorting coke off a girl's tits in Joburg. Um, I stayed the night. I stayed the night with the Welsh girl, shagged her for ages, uh, because I guess the cocaine played a part. Yeah. <laughs> and I was so fucked, I couldn't lift my head until gone 2 p.m. before I had to go to work. That is hilarious. Like... <laughs> Fuck. Wait, until he went to work? He went back to work the next day? He tried to fly the plane home the day after. Like he, like he fully Shit. went to the airport, got on the plane. The passengers were on the plane until the stewardess fucking saw him like fucking Snake, gurning, yeah. and yeah. was like, "Nah, this ain't happening." That's funny though. So what he rocked up? He's a man. He rocked up for work. Just like morning, Deborah. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Morning, Grace. Morning, Keith. And fucking just hopped in like nothing had happened. Hopped and in like nothing happened. Him. No, no one looked at him until the stewardess looked at him and thought, "This man ain't well. Like there's something a bit wrong, a bit <laughs> yeah, wrong he's here." Stuck there looking like fucking <laughs> Gurney Ernie, fucking just yeah. <laughs> jaws rocking. Yeah, man, I could not believe it. Couldn't fucking believe it, man. Because honestly, bro, I'm out of that plane. Right, if this plane takes off and I get that over the intercom, bro. I'm gone. I'm opening up that fire exit and I'm I'm yeeting out, yeah. brother. I've played enough Warzone. I know how to fucking land with a parachute. Done it. Been there, done it. I know where I'm landing. I'm dropping in. See you later. Ain't happening. Ain't happening. Not a chance. Ten hour flight. And my man's fucking on a come down. Nah. Nah. <laughs> Not a fucking chance. That plane's going down. That plane's on the come down as well. Fucking <laughs> that's up, brother. That's Into the crash. fuck. Yeah. That's madness, man. Yeah, yeah, man. That's, that's my new story that I found, man. Like, I couldn't believe it. Could not fucking believe it. That's funny, man. Fucking right. joke. I don't know if we want to get. I don't know if we want to get into like the reactions to the memes and stuff we've got because I honestly do not know how the audio is gonna go because you're cutting up a little bit and I have to unmute the desktop audio. Uh, we can no, save no. that for next stream if you want. We can, yeah, we can try it next stream maybe. Um, Jeez, yo, fine. Des, welcome in. Welcome in, Des. Oh, what? Yo, oh, my man, man Des. He's missed a fair bit. So what we can do, I, I just, to be honest, I really want to get off this browser scene as I think that's what's causing the issues. Yeah, man, get so off. what we're going to do, we're going to go on here and we're gonna, I'm going to upload a little picture. We're going to upload the tier list. We're going to upload the tier list here. And then anyone that missed it when we were doing it um, can obviously have their opinion. Obviously, it's a screenshot, so I'm not going to be able to edit anything in terms of the actual order and rank of everything on the screenshot. But obviously, I wouldn't even say it's controversial. I think it's fairly standard. There are some where it's like, I think it just comes down to personal preference. But that's all a tier list is, right? Absolutely, mate. Like, all a tier list this is someone right, let me quickly their... fix this crackle give me literally like two seconds should do a gbl challenge every match loss take every match loss take a shot i don't there's enough alcohol in the world i don't know if there's enough alcohol in the world because we, we will lose a lot um where did i put it i literally screen grabbed it saved it but i'm not sure where i saved it to did i save it to twitch stuff did I save it to Twitch stuff? There we go. I don't know where it went. Um, I actually don't know where it went. I literally saved the picture. So it should be on recent files. But that, that, that sounds like a fun challenge to do, fair, to be fair. Oh, there it is. Screenshot. Oh, it's on my desktop. That's why. For some reason, it's saved to desktop. I have no idea why. Be it. Right, we're going to... Bear with us, guys. We're going to get this picture up. And I'm just going to have a look over it one more one more time it doesn't help that i didn't rename it okay there it is there it is we're gonna sort of put it um 
we can enlarge it a bit not too much though we can put it there so it kind of covers up the bottom of chat but doesn't cover up our name the panel uh, tier apolog list yeah apologies if it's a bit small so she um hey yo he's been told that before says. yeah <laughs> i'm sorry it's small yeah i'm trying to do better i'm trying to be better be bigger i'm back on my <laughs> copium to turkey hotel wi-fi yo, what beers what turkish beers do they have what turkish beers do they have like is there any beer that's like you know obviously we've got a lot of spanish beers here a few italian beers and whatnot do they have any like turkish beers that are like sort of you know globally renowned i don't think they do um i don't think so not off the top of my head anyway Fuck it, we'll make this massive. It will cover both of us. Just yeah, go on, make, make it massive for me. Yeah, make it big for you. Oh, yeah. oh it's too big. Hey, yo. Can't... You can see the tops of our heads now. Look, right, it's there. And to be honest, we're covering up the bottom ones because the bottom ones are irrelevant anyway. So there. We can stab it like that. Oh, I yeah. See our shoulders. Right. So then you've got the. You've got Brewdog and Madrid at the top, followed by San Miguel, Moretti, and Corona. I keep forgetting the name of this one, so you'll have to... Which one? What's the name of that beer? Uh, Cruz Campo. Cruz Campo. Like, every time I look at that, I keep thinking of you. Have you watched Monsters University? Where it's like, who's Macapa? I'm like, who's Macapa? I keep thinking of, who's Macapa? I don't know why. Bud Light, Coors Light, and... What? Miller Light? I thought you said Muller Light. That's a yogurt. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> What's Miller Light? We should do a yogurt tier list. That would be fun. Cor nah, to be fair, Coors... Coors isn't that bad, but there are just better beers on there. Sorry, out. There's a lot of that move it down sort of thing. And to be fair, Bud Light is us. I can't lie. There's like literally there are so many. You've been to the UK. There are so many better beers. You know that. Very true. But a lot of them aren't that bad. The only ones that I'd say are like dog shit, like really bad. Oh, the bot. So you're looking at your Carlsberg. You're looking at your Becks, Red Stripe. Yeah, I've never had anything as bad as Red Stripe before, I don't think. Like, I've not had a great experience with it. I think because um, oh, there was one shift where, when I worked at the Students' Union, we had a load of Red Stripe, and a duty manager was giving it away because it was slightly out of date. And then me and my mate were drinking it, and our teeth, our teeth were, like, vibrating. It was, like, yeah, a great sensation. So that put it off. That put Red Stripe right down there for me. But other than that, most of the beers are actually all right. If you buy me most of those on the list, no matter where we've ranked them, I'll probably drink them. He's probably going to shag you. Probably, he's probably going to shag you, is what he's trying to say. Right, there's, there's just no need for that. <laughs> um, there's no need. But no, <laughs> Gavin said, if, right, Gavin took it one further. He said if he pisses in a pint glass and gives it to me, I'm drinking that. So... <laughs> <laughs> say less, say, say less. less. <laughs> oh, we should, we should oh. do. No, we should do. Um, oh, we should have had two set up, man. We should have had a beer one and a cider one set up. I can solve that out, guys. We do a cider one for next episode. True. Hey, also, also, Thomas, yeah. I've just realized we have no one in chat redeem the point redemption for do a shot yet. And to be honest, that's kind of criminal from you guys. If I'm gonna be quite yeah. honest, like. You know, like, like to be fair, people pe people might have read the the pinned thing and thought like so I'll put I put I know I put sound yeah. redemptions, but I literally put please save your channel points and spend them on shots. Yeah. What more can I what more can I do, Josh? There's not much more. Guys, do. go into your point redemptions now and if you've got it, redeem do a shot. We need to do one before the stream is over. Like, Come on. How, how low do you lot want me to put this fucking channel thing, man? You lot are gonna like, take the one. on like a normal day. Yeah. No, no, I, no, because I've had it as something stupid like that before. I've put it to like three hundred, and I've been rat <laughs> and I've done the same. Th I've done the same thing for the hot sauce one, and that was worse. And that's when I hurt myself. That's when I fucking. Uh, it's story time. I've not really had story time yet. Story time with Tom. So I don't know if you guys remember pussy. You're a pussy, -o. right? So basically, I remember I done a hot sauce challenge ages ago, um, where it was like every time I lose GBL, it's similar to what Des said. Um, every time I lost, I took a shot. But it wasn't a shot of alcohol or vodka or anything. It was just a shot of hot sauce. So I'd done fucking loads of them. I'd basically gone through a bottle and a half. 
And then I ended up, after, I had to lock off the stream. I was like, yeah, yep, yeah, guys, we're going to end the stream. Da -da -da. We're going to raid someone. Yep, let's raid Bubble Mouse. Cool, raided Bubble Mouse. And I ended up on the floor, took off all my clothes. Obviously, I'm off stream by hey, the guys. Yo. So I'm, I'm, not, I'm not live still. So I saw all my clothes. I'm just like fucking hyper fucking whatever on the floor, like just vibrating on the floor. Whatever hyper doing, whatever. Do, fucking... we, do, do you mean hyperventilating? That's not one. Whatever, hyper fucking, whatever. Yeah. No, I, I didn't know if... I knew the word ventilator came to mind, but I didn't know if, if that's what I was doing. Whatever. Right, Listen, I was fucked, out. yeah? So I was on the floor twitching like a fucking fox who'd been run over. So I'm there, like, twitching, twitching. No pun intended. Um, and then fucking... I had to get ice cream and yogurt out of the fridge and then can just eat it with my hands. I was just eating yogurt with my hands, going like... Eh, like, just to cool my mouth down. And Eva was so close to calling A&E. Like, she was like, you need to go to hospital. And I'm like, brother, no, I'm not going to hospital. It was bad. It was not a good moment for me. So, was this on my OF? Sadly not. So, Thomas, we've just been bought a shot by Mr. Yeah. Shep, big man Gav. Once, let me just redeem. Let me just do the hydrate. Thank you. Oh, uh, hydrate. Yep. Appreciate that. Apparently we're, not, apparently, we're not drinking quick enough, according to Mike. But then you lot ain't buying, you lot ain't getting a shot. So, let me just grab the, the Baileys. Fucking Bailey's, man. Come on, brother. What are you, fucking 50? Shut up. So, uh, Des, are you confirmed coming back UK next year for EYC? Or what? Oh, shot tier list is good, man. I, Mike. Okay, Mike. I'll, I'll, I'll put, put it this way. If you go on to the tier list maker... If you build us a tier list, we will do it next week. We've got another podcast coming uh, next Monday. If you build us a tier right, list, man. share the link with us, and we will do it straight up. All we're gonna, all we're gonna be doing is tier list, and then you lot are gonna be like, "Oh, you man are so dry. Yeah, you don't actually do tier list. <laughs> this is what you lot want. Yeah. So you lot are dry. You know what? I've just forgot the shot glass. I've brought the bottle, <laughs> two bottles. And forgot no, the no, shot no, glass. no, 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 neck it. Come on. Just swing it from the glass. Swing it from the bottle. You know what I bought though. You... So the Bally's. Yeah. The Raspberry Crush. Let's go, banging. Right, we'll go with the Bally's. Let's do it. Right. Chin chin, boys. Cheers for. Cheers, Cheers to love. Cheers, Cheers to honor. honor. If you can't come in, come on. Come in, come on. That is very nice. Yeah, fucking beautiful. What, what did you have? <laughs> what I have, brother, I've, I'm still on the fucking, I'm on the old uh, uh, honey run. Cocaine, or? Coked it's out, like banging. fucking pilot. <sighs> royal fuck shot? What's a royal fuck shot? Okay, that, okay, so, so tell us. So, no, 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 you, you were there. So, okay, so anyone who ch in chat who's not aware, so, um, April this year was uh, the uh, the Europe uh, yeah it was EUIC. Uh, I'm going to start saying European Union yeah. of international yeah, yeah. competition. Yeah. And uh, so uh, Des flew out from uh, Texas, bless him. And what a fucking great guy! Great to meet. Him. We flew it. We flew him out. We paid for his flight. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's it. Yeah, man. We, yeah, man, we're breaded straight up. Um, uh, it was the first time I'd ever like heard of him, met him. What a fucking great guy. Like, honestly, like, such a fucking nice guy. So, we do our social and whatever, blah, 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 which was, um, which was the night before. And the day after, like, we're all fucking hanging. Like, we are hanging. Yeah. And we're like, fuck it. We're just going to get back on it. So, we went to, uh, went to a German bar, Canary Wharf, Munich Creek Club. Brilliant fucking bar. Fucking amazing. And, um, and from there, we went to the Electric Shuffle, which is kind of like Canary Wharf's like end of night sort of place. So we're, we're drinking, 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 and Des is like, "Fuck him, man! I'm getting some fucking shots in, getting some fucking shots in." So we were all sat on a table, weren't we? Like, yeah. like there was you, me, my missus, it's Daniel, Dodie, yeah, this, is, this, is, this is the start of this is the start of fuck off, oh, turn off the fucking sound redemptions, but it's the start of fucking. Oyster card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got the oyster card. Yeah, yeah, man. And um, 
but like, oh, and, but by this point, Des has had quite a few steins, a beer, a few shots, many, either. Many, many steins. And yeah, and then Des, these steins are bigger than your future. Yeah, and then um, and then this waitress, this bar, rocks up with like, like, a plate full of fucking shots, basically, yeah. and we're like, the fuck is this? And he's like, oh, it's it's called ugh, it's called a royal it's fuck. Called- Said, it's called a royal fuck. Yeah, is that yeah. what he said or is that what she said? No, 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 no. No, that that's what he said. So like fair enough, fair enough. we're like, cool, like we'll fucking drink it, because you know, like we're fucking animals when we drink in it. So we drink them, yeah. bam. And the problem with ordering shots in England is once you order one, everyone else has to order one. So I remember games are rules. Yeah, games are like rules. the game's a game. So um so I think I got the next shot and I think my missus got the one after that. And I remember after yeah. just looking at Dez, because Dez is a big guy, brother. Like, Dez is oh, a I didn't realize. big not fucking that I had, guy. Not that I had, like, a pre... Not that I have, like, preconceptions of anyone yeah. anywhere. I don't think, oh, Dez, he's going to be, like, yeah. this tiny... But I just wasn't expecting the sheer man... man massive, man, brother. The fucking... M- my Dwayne, man is Dwayne, massive. Dwayne the fucking Rock Johnson. Yeah, it's straight up. fucking... I don't know, fucking Peter Crouch, like, and they have this fucking wham baby. Like, it's ridiculous. And I remember, I like, cause he stood next to me, like, which time? And we're just looking up at him, and like, he looks at me, and he goes, "Nah, man, like, I'm done. Like, I've got to go." <laughs> and I'm like, <laughs> "Why? Why are we just getting started?" And he looks me dead in the eyes, and it, uh, and he goes, and he goes, Please, no. uh, and he literally looks at me dead in the eyes, and he goes, y- "You guys over here in England do it different." And I'm like. I'm like, you're goddamn fucking right, yeah. we do. Please. Like, straight up. Please. Yo, Zarathos, welcome in. Yeah. We've, got another, we've got another redemption. But yeah, yeah, big up, Des. Des, I'm quickly going to go get my shot glass. But yes or no, are you coming to EUIC this year? He just said, yeah, you fuck. Where? I didn't fucking see that. Read it. Read the chat, brother. Actual streamer question mark. Come on. Oh, shit. I think I'm... No, but I didn't... Fuck you. That's when I went and got the fucking bottle. I must have missed when you asked him. Didn't ask yeah, you're a puss. Yeah, bro. Fuck, my, fuck my puss, innit? <laughs> yeah, no. That, it was fucking great. It was just the way this absolute mountain of our look to was like, no, nah, man, you, 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 you guys in England, you do it different. And I'm like, yeah, fucking goddamn right we do. We're fucking right we do. Yeah, man, I'm looking forward to recreating that EUIC, man. It's good. It's going to be a fucking blast. Oh, for fuck's sake, Zarephos, you redeemed sound redemption. I've muted the sound redemption. For Do it. Game. Say it. Yeah! Yes! Yes! <laughs> Alright, that's the only one I'm doing because Eva's just told me, informed me that I'm being too loud, so oops. Oopsie! Right, we've got to do another show. <laughs> oopsie, oopsie! <laughs> oopsie, I'm sorry, miss. Right. We've got to do another shot. Guys, should I do some GBL at 12? I don't know. I was going to do it at 2 p.m. tomorrow. That was part of my stream schedule. But, right. I don't know. Right, you want me to do another, you, you want me to do another toast? Uh, yeah, go for it. <sighs> right. Love toast. It's the pussy and gunpowder. L- uh, li- live by one, die by the other. Love the smell of them both. Cheers. Amen. Four horsemen shot, try this. But... Uh, bourbon whiskey. Oh yeah. Tennessee. Yeah, that is Scotch and Irish. No, that's right. So what you'll have? Um, so what you'll have like Jameson's, JD, Bell's, a decent Scotch Bell's, and um, like, what would um, what's a decent? I don't know, something like that. Yeah. But that, that yeah, that that would be fucking nice. No, I no, no, it's not. It's rough, rough as balls, man. I love whiskey. Um, them shots were banging. Yo, man, like Oyster Card, were you fucking... Yo, we t- nerfed, tap him we in, brother. We, ner- we nerfed it. We nerfed yeah. it. So no one, will, no one will hear it. But to be fair, I can just do it because it doesn't waste my channel points. We can, just so it comes up with um, his name and the beep. It's because he'll hear it in his head, even though no one else hears it. You guys won't hear it, by the way. But yeah, he's been tapped in now. A little silent, silent tap. No, those shots were nice. Yeah, man. You've got too many channel points. 
fucking Zara Claus. She's you know, bad channel points. <laughs> right, G guys. We're gonna wrap this up. Josh, what have you got? Um, what have you got planned for the next uh, week or so? Personally, Pokemon Go wise, in general. Oh what man, just Avalanche got planned. Nothing, man. I'm honestly, man. I'm looking forward to the next cast now. Like, like I love doing these. Yeah. The blast. Love them. Yeah. Um. Yeah. No, there's nothing really coming up. Um. Well, there's nothing. There's nothing, is there? Really, until uh. Until you go Barca. So. Guys, our our podcast schedule, if I'm correct, Thomas, correct me if I'm wrong. So we've got next Monday, 9 p.m., if I'm correct. Yeah. yeah. Now, say the, the chat, it's it's been somewhere in the chat, but I don't know if some of you guys weren't here. But obviously, we've got a big raid from Momo, so shout out to Momita again. Yeah, yeah definitely. And you missed it. Momo raided us. Why were you not part of the Momo raid? And True. second of all, why weren't you here? So you weren't on either of our streams, so... We need to have words. And, so, and the main thing I was going to say is we got botted. So we technically hit one point. We got big followers. Our follower account doubled in like fucking fuck 10 minutes. But all of those accounts are going to get banned. So we'll go back down to like 600 followers. You came in with a raid? What? It didn't say you were a raider. Hey, yo. Yo, capital capitalize. Got the sub. Zarafos gifted the sub to capitalize. Welcome in. Um. Yeah, no. Just GBL, so we're not yeah. So, fair enough, fair enough. so we've got we've got our next cast on the second, nine pm. Monday second, and no, then Monday after that, guys, second. which you guys might be excited about, uh, on on Monday the ninth, nine pm, we have a guest on the stream. Do we tell them now, or do we save it, or what? It's JD Underdog. We got we got, got big man J the Underdog. Man. Jay, the fucking underdog. The king of the bots. Guys, Great I, guy. I thought, king, I thought you said king of the bots. No, no, no. no, no, no. <laughs> and then... I'm about to say, come get your bread, and, like, fucking... and then, after that, on Wednesday the 18th, we've got another guest, which is actually going to be a live guest, correct? Live guest, yes. So he's going to be... Oh, we ain't got another chair. We might get another chair. Otherwise, he's going to be like, here, innit? Like, Mine's going to be doing the squat, yeah? <laughs> Mashing it out. No, I'm joking. Man's still running. Yeah, JD Underdog, the elite athlete, yeah, guys. Man. Two minute. Hey, yo. Oh, gifting, bear gifted subs. Who? Let's see. Guys, let's see who dodged. Oh, we've got Brown Baller got a gifted. I don't know this guy, but he caught life as well. Mohamed Uzumaki got a gifted sub. Ayo, it's Bueno. Hollandor, yo. Yeah. Bear um, gifted subs. Appreciate you, my man. Yeah, do you want to tell them five what, gifted subs? You want to tell them who the guest think, you want to tell them who the guest is for A team for Nah man. Um no I'm joking. Uh, I say we, we do a shot first because we appreciate all those gifted yes, subs. We do. And um and guys also even I, I, guys also I think I think Thomas will agree here. So we started this cast just because me and Thomas don't really actually get the chance to talk and hang out that much you know this is just an opportunity for us to do that so he tells me every day he was like i wish you lived in love bro life. straight up i do i like, i really do man. <laughs> yeah, I swear. Bro, I swear like, I do. but you know like but when you guys tune in and like you chat like honestly like we love it so like yeah. this one's to the yeah, chat the viewers yeah cheers everyone chin chin that's the most wholesome toast you've ever done if we're ranking it compared to Pussy and Gunpowder and don't come in or come on her. Yeah, that's very wholesome. Not there, man. Um, very, very wholesome. Oh, we actually do have an announcement as well before we finish up. Right, so, so the guest, first of all, the guest for Wednesday the 18th, as Josh was alluding to, who do you, who do you guys think it is? I'll give you a clue. They were in chat and... I think it was Gavin that said, are they, are they not an S-tier rated beer? So did, it's yeah, a very right. good beer. It's, it's a very good beer. It's not on our tier list, but it is a very good beer. Do you guys know what kind of beer might be our special guest? Let's have a look. Let's see. You know. You know. Okay. Well, mate, say it. Say it, okay. brother. Gifted sub forever names it now. 
Fucking hell, brother. Okay. Yo. Fucking more gifted subs. Okay. Oh, my Let's God. Let's dodge. Yo. We've got Phil. Got the gifted sub. Ever five cents. Sniper Mike. Onesie. Judy Wu, who's probably been in chat once. And now she's got a gifted sub. Yeah. We love that. A Welsh, Welsh variety. variety. A map beer. It is a map beer. You would be so correct, a... man. You would be correct. Yeah, we've man. got a map beer. 87. Coming on the stream. Yeah, He's man. He's going to be here. At my house, well, yeah, we're gonna be. Um, yeah, we're, we're gaffed. We shit. are gaffed. And we're gonna be talking some shit. And guys, one final big announcement for this. Like, sorry, I've just I've just ruined it again for you. Sorry, I just had to I just had to give Gavin a sub because <sighs> he keeps dodging. <laughs> Gavin kept dodging, so now he's not dodged. <laughs> okay, so nah, go on. so guys, so if you look in the chat, literally right now, okay. So, so this is what is going to happen. I'm going to post this link. The first five of you to hit sub, come back and say you've sub is going to get a free gifted sub because our first episode of the cast is now live on YouTube, completely live, live. uncut, unedited, and hopefully by tomorrow night we're going to be up on Spotify as well. So if you missed episode one of the cast with Kyle Nolan. It's all there. You can watch it. It's great. It's great fun, man. It's fucking great. Shep, you already have a sub. Fuck you. It goes to the next five after Shep. Yes. So, uh, so so five people that have not currently subbed to the channel. Yo, Des getting a gifted sub. Okay, Des getting a gifted sub. Let me hook him up. Let me hook him up real quick. Gift. Perfect tool. Guys, what do you think Fine. as well? Just like a, a bit forward thinking. What do you guys think about potential YouTube stream? I know Twitch is usually most people's preferred, but we could do a YouTube stream as well if enough people are interested. Wait, this isn't to your OF. No, sadly not. No free subs there. No, nah, not quite. We're gonna we're gonna start doing that, you know. We're gonna start guys, we're gonna go up to people at like any big pogo events with a mic. Hold on, wait, I've got the mic here. Oh for fuck's sake, I have to pull it out. I'm not gonna pull it out. Anyway, um, you go out with a mic and just be like, "Hey guys, do you guys want to come home with me or a free sub to my OnlyFans?" So we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna go around doing that. Do you want to come home with <laughs> me or a free sub to my Twitch? Yo, Red Red access. Flash, Red Flash has subbed. So guys, oh. if you guys don't know, Red Flash is the guy who designed the incredible artwork. Everything here, like for this channel, this. like literally incredible. We gave him so little to work off it is disgusting and how he Bro, came up with this is insane insane we gave him literal we we gave him nothing oxygen literal literally oxygen. nothing and then he made a fucking spaceship out of made a somehow. masterpiece masterpiece yeah he did uh, guys again so we've got three more remaining guys go go ahead sub, subscribe to the youtube channel come back in the chat Tell us you've sub and you will get a free gifted sub. Of course, Des, man. I got you, bro. But, but yeah, guys. I really, I really want those fucking... Watch those fuck shots or whatever they're called. They, they are I good, man. Them, they are good. I'll end up just calling them fuck shots. Yeah. But yeah, guys. Also, Nightbot literally just echoing what Josh said. The link to Red Flash's Twitter is there. So if you guys don't follow him already... First of all, what are you doing? Second of all, follow him because his work is amazing. His work he is does a lot of incredible. He does a lot of stuff for other streamers, other content creators, um, other esports organizations. So he does like the elite TMs stuff as well. Yeah, great right guy. Yeah, and great guy. hopefully in the near future we're gonna have some more work done by him. We're gonna keep upgrading. Yes. We we want to keep this going. Keep upgrading. Five stars on TripAdvisor. Five stars on TripAdvisor. Straight up, man. Come again. Straight up, man. But yeah. Um, come again. All right. Let me gift out the rest of these real quick. Let's just do this. Fuck it. Mm -hmm. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, no, while, you're doing, while you're doing that, I'm trying to think. Any other any other plans until Barcelona? Or are you kind of just waiting? Right. So, Apart from the cast, obviously. So, until... Barcelona, I'm just going to be working out, keep fucking shredding them pounds, because 
Like, I, I'm trying to enjoy these chips, man. I'm trying to enjoy them. I was going to say, I, I would say you look great, but, like, it's hard. To, like, the pixels look good. <laughs> the pixels <laughs> always look good, isn't it? Like, always. The, 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 pix, the pixels look banging, guys. What do you think? But yeah. Um, yeah, guys. But like I said, if you missed episode one of the cast, go on for YouTube watch. And if not, uh, check out me and Thomas on socials because we're going to post the link to our Spotify copy tomorrow. Um, and yeah, man, we're going to we're going to keep going because this shit is fun, man. I love it. I I love it. It's so good. That is good. It's good. I subscribe. Can I get? I can't give you a sub because you're already. You're already subbed, and I can't add on like another. I can't add on another month. It doesn't work like. Yeah, this, it doesn't work like that, sadly. But don't, don't worry, don't worry. You've, you say you've done a lot. You can get a shout out though. We can give you, we can give you a shout out because you've given yeah, man. You sure. so many subs. I don't know how much it's costing in lira. Um, Twenty pounds. All my Turkish, all my Turkish dons. <laughs> bring up all the Turkish royalty in the chat. That's bring up, cool. bring up Matt Beer, who's in Turkey as well. Love that man. You know, just big up Turkey, isn't it? Straight up. But, um, yeah, I say for me, um, guys, I don't know if I'll do a GBL stream. Guys, should I do a GBL stream at midnight? Yeah, should man, it fuck it. You might as well, innit? GBL stream at midnight? Yeah, man, why not? Bro, okay, so I've got to jump off, but, bro, just stay on. Just chat a bit, innit? Might as well, guys. When when I say I put a stream schedule and I put in my Discord that I'll try my best to stick to it, it I literally mean that. Like, I'll Out the window. If I want to stream, I'll just stream. It just yeah. That's why I never bothered with one. Josh is always like, oh, put a stream schedule up. You need to. And I know I need to. I know how important it is yeah. to have an air of consistency about what you're doing. But I just, I'm spontaneous. I'll just do it. So, guys, if you guys want to stick around for another half an hour or so, we're going to do some GBL at midnight. Open Great League, we're not doing none of this psychic nonsense, but yeah, guys, in terms of the podcast, we're going to wrap it up, so I'm probably going to end the stream and then start the stream again, just um, just so it's less for us to trim down on YouTube and whatnot, and um, oh, yeah. Yeah, you guys get another you guys get another notification, which is great. Oh, yeah, man. Obviously. Yeah, guys, uh, Josh, thank you everyone for tuning in. Pleasure. Thomas, as been a always. pleasure as always, brother. Much love. Love to see it. And yeah, man, peace out, everyone. Uh, look after yourself, guys. See you later. All right, guys. Say bye to Josh. See you later, chat. We're going to end the stream and then we're going to restart it again. So don't go anywhere unless it's your bedtime. Then definitely go to bed. Peace out, guys. Yes. Bye. All right. All the best. Bye bye.